Hello, YouTube. Good hey, afternoon. Hey, everybody. See, I'm not muted today. I'm not <laughs> anything. Our internet is up and working. Woohoo! So, yes, welcome, welcome. Hey, Peggy. <clears throat> Mama Lou, Dove Season, Shaw, Cheryl. Hi, everyone. Um, yeah, so yesterday they were working across the street from us and they cut a cut a cable. So that's what happened with our internet. Right just before coin ops was gonna start the actual auction. It was like what? Where's our what what? Right. And it was nuts because Joe got phone service and was able to be on there, but I couldn't get phone service and we have two different services, but his phone's newer, so of course. Of course. So <laughs> anyway, Shaw's prospecting. Good to see you. I wanted to thank Robert and Floor for filling in for us. Yes. Yesterday doing both auctions. I know that was uh, trying. So today, it's our turn to be trying. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be doing the 2 o'clock auction right now and 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. We'll yeah, doing... we're going to do a double double hitter. <laughs> so tonight is all world coins. And Tonight. today mm -hmm. is, uh, well, today is just a regular auction. We have a mix, nice mix. So that's that, yes. Um, right on, right on. Thank you guys all for being here. We appreciate you all very much. Yes, thank you for coming. I know it's been chaotic and crazy and it's confusing sometimes, but you guys rock. Ooh, ooh, yep. So. With that, I have a. Oh, I don't need to have me on there. Oh, Diane, what are you going to be camera ready today? Huh? Is Mr. Roman here? Is Mr. Roman here? Does he only <gasps> get one shot? <laughs> one shot. That's all you get. That was it. Oh, let's do it. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Just teasing. All right. Oh, and I let's see. To see it, so there you go. Ha! 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 Well, we can always remedy that. Uh, hey, Bigfoot, how are you, buddy? Floyd, good to see you. Good to see you. He took off. There's silver on the list. What do you mean? Barber quarters, barber or mercury dimes. Uh, mercury. Mercury dimes. <laughs> there's mint sets. I caught it. Well, there's proof sets. There's all kinds of things. That's probably half silver. Cheryl Boston's here, Bigfoot, my big, big foot. Hey, Boy, Bill four five you. seven. How are you? Dove season. Hello. Um, what was I? You took off work for this, uh, did you? Um, <laughs> Kevin is here. Hey, Kevin, how are you? <laughs> you Mama have, uh, Lou. John RMS. Mama Lou. Channel link. What? You have John RMS's link. Oh yeah, hang on. So yeah, if you guys don't have uh, Ace Bullion, John RMS. Oh uh, yeah, we got a couple of things going on. Um, be sure to check out his channel. Diana will post the link. Here's John uh, RMS. There's still room to get in on the one kilo bar he's giving away. You have it's a uh, thirty-five dollars American U.S. or you can send him a one ounce silver round. And don't forget Oz Art. Go visit him. And you can get two spots on that kilo bar kilo bar up to two spots two count them one two um he also put out a video today he is uh doing channel memberships so you guys check that out um i didn't yeah. go check that out we have oz art also he's our mod extraordinaire be sure to check him out for all your uh graphic, graphic designs wood mm -hmm. burnings you name it he yeah. does it um Red and he's red. a great guy he's doing a push for his 1000 and he'll be giving away some coin bells and uh, a bunch of other gifts yep. uh redneck metals auction is this sunday at 5 30 eastern yeah and uh so go check out a bunch of the nice prototype pours from all the redneck metal guys that's always a good time and yeah that's that's what i have to say thank well, you Les. you guys were not aware hey most hated I sent out emails hoping that we could get detailed information out to you. Um, packages did not go up today in lieu of yesterday's activity. Um, well, 
anybody that wanted to be shipped. Yeah, those got be. shipped because, you know. And those that wanted got shipped today? Yep, absolutely. But for the most part, yeah, because if you give me a big production. Anyway, they are going to go Monday. And then you know what? After Monday's shipping, I am like what? disappearing from everything. That's what you think. Hey, 4K, how are you? 4K's here. Harry Good Hart. afternoon. Depending upon what part whoop, of the whoop. world you're at, morning for him, afternoon for some, evening for others. Is it even well it depends? If you're in Australia, it's actually morning tomorrow. Yes. Hi Ho got his plane bells, Diane, and he put up a video. Very, very happy man. That's Good. Cool. Hey, uh, America, how are you, buddy? You're welcome, Dove Season. I'm so glad. America's here and he's driving, though. Aha, right on, Joe Sharp. How are you, buddy? Who was good at pouring your local design? Pouring? That would be Redneck. Yeah, Red. Well, is, there's all know. kinds of good pours, but Red's done a bunch of pours for us, custom yeah. pours, and he does an awesome job. You got Scrap and Horton. He can do those, too, but I don't know how busy he is right now. All the Redneck medals. You know what, guys, Peggy? You nice. need to go... Sunday night at 5 30 Eastern to their auction and see the different pours and what they do, and then you be the judge. How's that? Right on. That's what I suggest you do. So hope you're doing well, Joe. And capture your, that link. Joe Sharp, your package did get shipped out today. So Red and thank Bradley. You for, uh, oh yeah, Bradley Height. He yeah. does pouring. That's right. He's one of the med neck metals yep. guys, yeah. I can't remember all of them yet. Hey, SMS. When I'm in there that I know. Oh, let's see. There's backyard scrapping. There is um, Red, Bradley, uh, Brian's World. Oh, wait. Here's There's... my list. Okay. Oh, John Wolf. Yeah. Thank you, Joe. We appreciate you very much. Who's Dino? Dino is, uh, that's backyard scrapping. Then there's. Um... Full push. Yeah, I'll just let you do it. Read your list. Who's uh, Sledge It? Uh, you're telling me their emails. I have no clue. Okay, I don't know who these guys are. Okay. So we have Carrie, Twisted R Racing, Backyard Scrapping. Okay. Full Push, Redneck Metals, Brian's World and Mechanic, um, John Wolf, Bradley Height, Dean. You know that's backyard. Oh, is it? Okay. That's the ones I can remember. Hey, Al Stacker, how are you, buddy? There's our friend from from Idaho. Hope you're doing well. Hey, Roadrunner, good to see you. All right, it is. But well, we have a few minutes. I'm waiting on on a couple things here. We'll be starting it. <laughs> Turkey sandwich. What? <laughs> Who's turkey sandwich? Joe Sharp, hello. <laughs> Watching from Boise. Yep, scrapping, hoarding, tinkering, fun. I thought I said him, but I might not have. Rich I H is here. Very cool pours from him. There's Majestic. Hey, Majestic. Hey, Rich H. Turkey sandwich. Welcome, you guys. Um, Yay. Hope everyone is doing well today. It's a... It's a uh, Chilly day today what is in it? the neighborhood. It's a balmy, like 58 degrees here. Yeah, it's like, where's the heat? Woke up this morning, I was like, no, I'm not turning. You might want to deny that. I'm not turning uh, the, the heat furnace on. on? No. Yeah, it was like 40 degrees this morning. Shaw, are you bored? I'm sorry. <laughs> well, if you haven't noticed, Shaw, we don't have a moderator in here to call this yet. I, like I said, we're waiting on a couple things. Well, in the meantime, first time bidders. Thank you, Diane. Please send an email to Joey Durbin 876 at gmail.com. Give us your details, such as the name, address, and your PayPal address. And be sure to let us know your YouTube name if it is different. It's very important because we won't be able to find you or approve you or, you know, all that good stuff. There's Anna Hutchinson. Hi, Anna. She's here. Oz is here. Hey, Oz. How are you, buddy? If you do live outside of the United States of America and have a outside of the U.S. address, send $5 PayPal to joeydurbin876 at gmail.com for goods and services. Uh, this helps us to calculate your shipping charges. That $5 will be reimbursed or actually deducted, deducted. would be a better phrase. Deduct. From your, yeah. From your first purchase. 
um, that just makes it easier for me to be able to calculate what your shipping is going to be. That's, that's how I, I have found. That's how I calculate Diane's wages. <laughs> yeah, right. So many deductions that, gosh, she just never gets a check. Uh -huh, right. Come on, honey. <laughs> you got to get with the program. I am with a program you're oh. falling short. Well, there'll be a little something extra. There'll be a little something extra this week. <laughs> it must be 18 years of age and older to bid. That means, and you also have to have a United States address, unless, of course, other arrangements were made through the PayPal as discussed earlier. Now, uh, Peggy, we we don't do like Venmo or anything like that, but we, if you want to email us, we can figure something out with like a. Personal check, or I think Google Pay we can do too. I have to just look into it. We'll, so, we'll figure it out. But we'll figure it out. So it's no worries, Peggy. Hey, Red, how are you, buddy? Hey, baby boy. How are you doing? Steel Horse, how are you? Rockzilla, oh my goodness. There's all kinds of people in here. I know. Welcome, look welcome. at the cool folks are here so far. Thank you guys for all the thumbs up. We appreciate it. By the way, as you know, we do um, invoice after every auction. If you have an outstanding invoice, don't worry about that. At the moment, we just update it, and then it's good. And that also will keep your um, shipping up to date. Um, shipping is $3.55 to $8, depending upon weight and size and such. Hey, um, mud. Which is, and that's here in the United States. That's not out of the United States. That's a whole different ballgame. I hope. Anyway, uh, we are shipping Monday. So all invoices in order to ship Monday need to be paid by Sunday. No questions. Not half, not some. Well, I'll ship what is paid. There you go. However, hey, mud, hey, uh, if you're shipping, I hope. <laughs> if you're shipping or lack of shipping has to do with what's waiting to be paid, the whole package will be held. But we understand how that works. Just making sure people understand. Thank you for your kind words and your video, hi ho. I appreciate you. I'm glad you're happy with your bells. Geez, you're you really rad. Good job. All right. So you again, started your day off spilling coffee on your graphic key. Oh no! Right, he, he shot me a text. That's we were waiting a little bit for Oz to clean up his little mess. Graphic keyboard <laughs> oh. and white coffee or carpet. That's no place for coffee. No, vinegar's good. Yep. Just saying. Vinegar's nasty. Oh, it eats <laughs> up all the gunk. And oh. with that being said, it's two o two. Let's get this auction Hi -ho. started. Hi Again, welcome everyone. Good luck today. Thank you um, for coming. Appreciate your patience with everything yesterday. Right. And Remember, all of you who went over to Coin Ops, I appreciate you doing so. Well, we do. Yes. And remember? Also, remember, uh, 7 p.m. today, we will have our second auction filling in for yesterday. So I'll post that list a little bit later. Yes. And one other uh, quick thing tonight on Big T's channel at seven eastern is the gleason benefit auction for his wife his wife is uh is going through chemo for cancer and uh so they're having a benefit auction tonight and i'm going to be bouncing over there just before we go live and and uh, auctioning off a bell for them so, so if uh, we're a little late that's why we I'll won't be, be late. in here and so i just wanted to get that clear oh lemon juice i didn't think about that steel horse um, but you're right so yeah, if you guys, any of you can make it over and support Gleason and, and uh, his family, that'd be great. Yes. Uh, they're going through a real trying time, and just keep them in your prayers. And with that, we will start the auction. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys, for your patience and listening to me cut Joe off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm used to it because I married that woman. All right, here we go. Did you just do that? What? <laughs> so our first lot today is two barber quarters now these are well circulated barber quarters here's Do 1907 you? oh you own a cleaners that's cool yeah now i know who to call or email to find out how do i get this out <laughs> so we have a 1907 and a uh how do eight, i get that Durban out? i mean uh 1897 <laughs> Sorry. Not while we're talking about the coins. <laughs> this one's a little more war than the first, but nonetheless. Oz's chat froze up. Oh my goodness. So we have an 1897 and 1907, a pair of barber 
quarters, and we were looking for opening bid of eight dollars. Eight dollars for this beautiful Berber. Oh wait, it's a barber. Barber. <laughs> That's very cool. So dove season comes in at eight. Cool, Joe okay. Shark. That's awesome. Thank All you. All I dove had season. to do yesterday, Oz, was hit the live chat again and it came back. I don't know what that was, but mine was freezing up last night. On we thought maybe it was from all that craziness, but apparently other people were too. <laughs> Good to see you, Johnny Ray. Hey, Johnny Ray. We have dove season at eight dollars. Thank you, dove season. Again, that. 1907 and an 1897. Two barber quarters, one money. One money. He's late. He's late for a very auction day. Uh, That's funny. All right. How are you doing, Cheryl Busman? So we got $8 from Dove Season. Do we hear $8.50 or $9? Miss Cheryl Busman, the most positive lady on YouTube. She is very positive. Well, hello, the Spaminator. Spaminator's here? Whoop, whoop, we can really get going now. Johnny Ray's here, Red Mix here, Speminator's here. Who's missing? That's weird, Oz. So we have eight with Dove Season. Do we have any other interest? Strange. Pair of Barber Quarters, a 1907 and an 1897. Maybe you got to put your keyboard in. Two for one money. Make me sort of just soak up all the liquid. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Let's get a 25-pound bag of rice there, buddy. Well, maybe it was rice. That's what it was, rice. And then you have to shake it to get all the little kernels out of the uh -huh. keys. Oh, that's not. Which, which one, Floyd? It must be the 1907, huh? Maybe we should just get a, what do you call that? Then? That's funny. Air hose. We're going twice. Right on, Bill. She is. Fair warning. And... Fair warning. You pick. <laughs> Sold to Dove season. Hey, Big Flip. How's it going? Hello, hello, hey, hello. Big Flip. How are you, buddy? Congratulations, Dove season. Congrats, Dove season. First one goes to you. Nice pickup. For $8. Hope you're doing well, Big Flip. I saw you were gone fishing for a little bit there. Yeah, how was that? Dove. But that was fun times. Well, where's my sticky? My 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 labels. Uh oh. All right. Fun, fun, fun. No, thank fun, you, Dove fun, Season. Fun. Awesome. Since my daddy took the keyboard away. Yay. All right, next up I have. <laughs> Moving for my labels. Mm-hmm. Boom. All right. Let's oh, do it this shit. way. I thought I picked this up. Did it not go? Next up, I have four Mercury Dimes. And we're going to start with the 1940 Philly. I got I'm it. I'm sorry. I thought I did that. That's all right. Weird. Okay. So what 19, part of your heart is at 10? 40 Philly. 41 Philly. I have a 42 San Francisco. Come on, camera. Well, let me get my trusty tool out there. There we go. 42. That is a San Francisco. Whoa. There's your S mint mark. And finally, a 43 San, San Francisco. We got 4K at 11 after Perry Art came in at 10. Get that. There's after your Dove estimate season mark. and Steel Horse at 6. So four Mercs, one money. Um, You're going to go to the Yellowstone? That's cool. That'll be cool. Flip. That's that's one of the places on my uh, bucket list. Yep. Absolutely. So there you are, 41, 40, 41, Phillies, 43, and 42 and 43, San Francisco, Merck Dimes. And uh, I have Cheryl at $12. Thank you, Cheryl. Thank you all for your bids. Ah, oh, sorry, Perry Art. 
what the material is that Calgon use you use. Um, oh, this, that's just that foam. This one's sheets. just foam. This one, the I have these also that are just out of a airtight or a snap tight. I dug these off. Just that does work really good, Joe Sharp. Thank you, Joe. As a matter of fact, well, you saw coin ops was using that idea. But yeah, the one out of the the uh, air tights or snap tights, they're already cut, so you don't have to mess with the uh, getting a nice looking circle. You got four K at thirteen. I'm looking for fourteen. That. We got four K at thirteen. Looks very hard. Comes in at fourteen. Right, no, uh, glad we get steel it horse. Joe. I want to see jelly stone before it blows up. <laughs> 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 you think it'll blow up really i hope not. oh the volcano thing is underneath there there's a vault or something i'm not really sure but 4k perry arts coming in at 14 so now we're looking for 15 y'all you bet joe so if all in no done we'll call it down last call last call 4k is out and now we're gonna go once is a fall up here already yeah well no yeah <laughs> not really it might be starting to, it, this was the first week that we've had any cooler weather but it's supposed to get warmer johnny ray towards the weekend are you up here now johnny down in brooklyn park sure it comes in at 15. that's right he was driving to minnesota today yes he was we got Cheryl Busman at 15. Looking Cheryl at 16. 15. Thank you, Cheryl. Yeah, it's a cool, cool day up here, Johnny. You're about two and a half hours south of us. Yep. My father lives down there in Brooklyn Park. 90 degrees. Uh, I'd take the 60. Yeah, I'll take the 60. It's been nice not having to run the air conditioner, have the windows open, let the house breathe a little bit. So far, the pollen hasn't drove me crazy yet. The other day it did, but that's because I mowed and had run into trees and limbs and stuff. And anyway. Thank you, Perry. All so right. we're going once. Going Charles months. got this at 14, looking for, I mean, 15. I'm looking for 16. Fair warning. Sold to Cheryl for $15. Congratulations, Cheryl. Congratulations, Cheryl. For $15. Whoop, whoop. You're awesome, Cheryl. We love you, ma'am. Uh, I'm going to go check the door. Hey, Bob. Cheryl. Congratulations, Cheryl. Thank you, ma'am. All right. Um, next up, I have. Hey, Bubs. I have a pair of uh, commemorative half dollars. First off, this one's in Littleton packaging. This is the 1986 Statue of Liberty proof. These are clad. And then I have the 1986 well, Denver. And this is uh, the business strike. Again, this so. is clad. So we have two commemorative half dollars, one money. San Francisco and a Denver business strike and a proof. And we got $5 opening bid on those. Nice. Thank you. Very nice. Yeah. Yes, I did, Paul. I missed your first high. Mr. and Mrs. maybe messed you guys up. So, <laughs> no spam just for me, huh? The case just got here for, well, there you go, Paul Hampton. We got 4K at 5, looking for 550 or 6. 4K at 5, looking for 550 or 6. What is going on? Those look really nice. So those are clad commemorative half dollars. And he said SOL. 
you know, making me jealous. Talking about your cool weather, it's nine degrees, it's seven. Eight. Oh, I know, I know. The south is getting hit, kind of warm stuff, but it's it that's promising to get cooler. Um, Terry Nossinger is at six. Thank you, Terry. Thank you, Terry, for your bid. Sorry about that. I had a it's visitor. Awesome. Yeah. So yeah, there we. Um, Proof and a business strike of the Statue of Liberty commemorative halves. Um, thank you, 4K. We got 4K at $7. Um, so the business strike is in the original government package. And the uh, proof is in a Littleton packaging, but it appears to be in the original, original airtight. Paul, he's got more spam than he knows what to do with. He's got more spam than he's got hair, I bet. On his head, anyway. <laughs> he's got a few whiskers on his face, I think. If you can find it between the ho-ho crumbs and the, well, you know, spam grease. 4K at $8. Thank you, Terry. Thank you, 4K. Thanks, Oz. <laughs> and remember, everyone, there's your man if you don't have Oz art. Um, copy and paste that that name and search it and he'll subscribe to that channel he does some awesome wood burnings uh, graphic designs he'll be doing t-shirts and decals here shortly you name it he can do it he does thumbnails uh, intros extras you name it he does it so there you go A little shameless plug for our ozark mod extraordinaire 4K is holding strong at eight. Going once. Hey, Phil. 14 easy payments of six pesos. <laughs> Philly Go boy. Twice. How are you doing, Phil? It's always good to see Fair you. Fair warning. Fair warning. See you leaving. I mean, it's always good to see you. <laughs> <laughs> right on, Oz. So we've got. We have uh, 4K. 4K, yes. Congratulations, 4K, by the way. It's good to see you again. Congrats, 4K. Thank At you, sir. $8. You are welcome, and thank you, 4K. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you, bidders. Nice pick up, 4K. Thank you, Terry, and 4K. Whoop, whoop. That's very cool. Congratulations. Thank you, guys, so much. Yes. Rose Dragon's here. Hello, Hi, Rose, Rose Dragon. Dragon. <laughs> oh, paying bills. Ooh. Yeah. Got to do it. That's right. All right. Next up, we have a lot of six clad proof Washington quarters. First up, 1990. Then we have a 91. Ninety two. Ninety-one, ninety-two, ninety-three, ninety-three. You see a theme going here. Hmm. Do we have ninety-four, ninety-five? Ninety-four. Oh, look at there. And we got just to throw a five. monkey wrench in there, we're going to do a ninety-seven. Monkey wrench threw you off. No ninety-six. We got a ninety-seven instead. That's right. So six clad. Proof quarters, one money. Peggy Hunts at five, Paul Hampton at five fifty, and Peggy Hunts comes back at six. Thank you all. <clears throat> Thanks, Shaw. So we have Peggy Hunts, everything at six. Yes, those are clad. I mean, <clears throat> really? <laughs> one of them would be six dollars probably if they were silver. But just saying. Thank you, Floyd. Hey Joe. Yes, ma'am. Your FedEx guy came. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, this is the mail, not FedEx. Is it the mail? Yeah. That was a different person. You're right, it's the mail. Hey, Patriots mom, how and are you? We got our shirts, coin up shirts today. Oh, they came too? Mm-hmm. That's, that's not that, shirts. No. Okay. Gotcha. Hello, Paula. How are you, ma'am? Paula's here. What? Good to and see Paula you, Paula. is in it. $10. Thank you, Paula. 
Here's our shirts. All sweet. Pro Stitch prints. Oh boy. We'll Can't be, wait. Good timing. It's cold out. We'll be rocking some coin ops. <laughs> swag tonight. Swag. We'll be swag and swag and swag. We need to get our own to shirts. say that. <laughs> Oz, you cracked me up, buddy. <laughs> Patriots mom, it's always good to see you. You're a sweet, sweet lady. We're doing wonderful. Thank you. Bill457 is out. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Bill. We'll look at 411. Who's yep. Paula Bloom is in the lead. Strong. Holding strong at 10. $10. Again, six. You're off proof. today, Patriots mom. Hey, nerd analyst. How are you, sir? She's in here lurking. Okay, so six clad proofs, one money. We have Paula Bloom. One swap. Hello. In the lead at ten dollars. Thank you, Paula. Going once, looking for eleven. We got Paula holding strong at ten. So glad you're here, Patriots mom. Just adore you. Good, you get to hang out, you get to listen, and you get to giggle. Right. <laughs> Rosebud. Hey, hello. Rosebud. How are you? Fair warning. That's right, Bill. Four, five, seven. Fair warning. We usually do that after going twice. Well, <laughs> Bill's got to try. Yes. Going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, what will you do? Oh, Paula, we've got snipers lurking in here too, but it's sold to you, Paula Bloom. Congrats, Paula. Thank you, ma'am. Congratulations, Paula. Thank you. And thank you, bidders. Yes, thank you all for your bids there. For Ten dollars. Paula Bloom. Well, cool. Glad I didn't. Well. There you go. No Oof. shipping on for her. There you go. <laughs> She's got one from before. Oh, right on. Awesome. All right, next up. Please send them to Red. Send Abs them to Red. Absolutely, Paula. You got it. Thank you. Congratulations, Red. That was very nice of you. Red, you got a treat from Paula Bloom. No M&Ms for you. No M&Ms. No. You're, All right. You're on an M&M &M change. Ah. <laughs> Next, I'm going to have to find different flips for these. Yeah. they got all kinds of scribbling on. But this is a 1907. This is a little better condition than that lot we Sandy did earlier. Now? Yeah, Sandy has quarters. 1907 Denver. I look at it, With Love from Helen. Aw. That's so sweet. And we are looking for <laughs> $5 on this. Well, Helen, Helen we're is... moving forward, darling. And there may be... There may be some hairlines on this now that I look he at it. Does. So very keep that in good. Mind. We got high ho at five and dove season at six. Thank you, uh, hi ho. Thank you, dove season. So again, with love, a Denver, nineteen oh seven Denver, um, barber quarter. With love. With love. How can you not get that one? It's being sent with love. And let me flip her back over to the obverse. Majestic's calling in seven. Thank you, Majestic. How are you doing, buddy? It's good to see you. He's had a busy, busy week himself. Six, five, okay, 1995. What? This went to this guy, Wally Buckler. With love from Helen. That's cool. Oh, wow. I did. I was wondering what the heck you were talking about. I'm reading so what, your slab or your flip. Oh, yeah. A bunch of these I just picked up at an auction. So. Local one, too. Yeah, it was just. That was interesting. Just Hello, Movado. Hey, Movado. How are you? Awesome, Majestic. That's great. I know. Isn't that cute, Paula? So where are we? We have Hi Ho at $8. I don't know what happened to Wally, but dang it, they're selling off his coins. Poor Wally. I have a couple of Wally's coins up today, actually. Oh, well, we got a break to Majestic is out. Thank you, Majestic. Thanks, Majestic, for your bid. We got high ho at eight. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Uh, I told you not to call me big sexy in public. <laughs> you. Oh, you didn't you weren't talking to me, Diane? <laughs> <laughs> All right.
right. That was over the top. That was over the top. Hey, dime bag Darren. I wonder if there was. No, it's sitting in that flip crooked majestic. Oh, it could have been his birth year. You got a point there. I'll try to center it. You know how they staple crooked sometimes, but no, it doesn't appear like it's off center. Dime bag's here. It's just the way it's in that flip. What happened to Wally? Wally Buckler. We don't know. Buckle. Buckler. Going once, going twice. Thank you, Shaw. Yeah, smack up that like if you guys don't mind. That'd be awesome. We should give Wally a chance. I don't know. <laughs> a chance to bid. <laughs> Sold to Hi Ho. Congratulations, Hi Ho. For $8. Congratulations, Hi Ho. Hi Ho. Hi Ho. Hi Ho. Okay, honey, that was over the top. I think you blew my ear eardrum. Did it tickle? A little bit. Good. Just saying. Good. <laughs> that means you still have sound in there. I do. I have a strange singing in my ears all the time. Hi ho! Send to the big show. You got it. This is going to Paula. Do the big show. Thank you, hi ho. Yep, yep, yep. Congrats, Paula, for the big show. Big show. To the big show. Very cool. Thank you, Hi-Ho. You're awesome, buddy. Very much so. Yep, yep, yep. Very All cool, right, very next cool. up. I have a pair of commemorative half dollars once again. First is 1992 gymnastics. These are clad. Um, remember only the 1982. There's a few fly specs on the reverse of this one. But it is in the original government packaging nonetheless. And I have the proof. 92 proof business uh, and the business strike. So that's what we have up this next item. And uh, yes, remember the only years of the silver commemorative half dollars are 1982 and 1993. The George Washington commemorative is 1982 and the Bill of Rights James Madison commemorative is 1993. And those are both 90 percenters, so wonderful. Just saying, just saying. Wait, wait, Oz put it up. Thank you, Oz. Oh no, I got the wrong list over here. Well, that's no, you had it up too, I guess, but all right, Paula. That's funny. What the coin with all the writing? What about it? I'm <laughs> sorry, I'm not in there. I'm I'm dealing with them. nothing. She just said, "Can I keep the flip?" She was joking. Oh. So we have Paula in at six dollars. <laughs> Thank you, Paula. Sorry, Paula. Thank you, Oz. I, I didn't, didn't see that she had it up above, but I didn't want to miss what was said. Right, it is part of the coin story. That kind of is what makes some of them interesting. Stories sell, facts tell. See, actually, the I think uh, what was his name? Buckler. What was his first name? Wally. Wall, Wally. Buckler. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I think Wally was married to Shirley Buckler, <laughs> and I think that his mother, her mother, gave her these coins to the next one I see. Oh, interesting. <laughs> oh, we got Majestic at, let's see. Yeah, Majestic at eight. High Hole was at seven. Majestic was at seven. Paula is out. Thank you, Paula. So the, uh, these are the 92 gymnastics commemorative half dollars. These are clad the uh, San Francisco and the Denver, I believe. Yes. No, Philly in San Francisco. And we are at $8. Eight. And happy Paul Hampton comes in at $8.50. Bigfoot is out. Paul is out. Thank you, guys. Majestic is out. Bigfoot, Paula. Yep. Um, Paul Hampton, he just comes in and spaminated everybody. Spaminator. 
Thank you, Paul. We're going once. Going once, going once, going twice. Whoa, lady. Bring her down just a little bit. Sensitive today, Joe? No. Just, hmm. just my ears. Sold the happy Paul Hampton for eight fifty. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Paul, for your bids. Congratulations Paul. and thank you, bidders. Paulie Wog. Thank you, Paul. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Okay, you're a gentleman. Or no, you're a scholar. He can be whatever he wants to be. He's Paul. He's the a spaminator. Professor of spaminology. <laughs> <laughs> Thank professor you, sir. of spaminology. That's okay. funny. Okay, next up we have a 1969. P and D uncirculated U.S. mint set. So in this mint set, you'll have a forty percent silver Kennedy half. But this is a oh, sealed I I did this. sealed mint set, so I'm not going to open it. Whoever wins this can open it. So an unopened 1969 P and D U.S. mint set. Uncirculated, excuse me. And we have so Peggy at eight and Bigfoot at ten. Thank you guys. Peggy comes back at twelve. Thank you, Peggy. Thank you, Peggy. Good to see you. Keep thank you for your bid. <laughs> I was thinking something else. Well, Bigfoot hit was at ten. Peggy hunts is at twelve. After coming in at eight, and Bigfoot comes back at thirteen. No shot. It has a silver forty percent silver half dollar. There are no silver dollars. Tell in you mid about sets. the big show. Let me tell you about the big show. <laughs> well, you know what? And yeah, Oz, the big show is on every other Sunday at, uh, uh, I think it's, oh, I don't remember the time, seven this or going uh, to the big show too. Eight Eastern. Okay, I got it, Paul. Thank you, yep, Paul. Yep. Got it. Dude, Out the big to Bigfoot. Show. Thank you, Peggy. Yeah, Johnny Ray at 15. Thank you, Johnny Ray. Let me tell show. you about the big show. So there will be a big show this Sunday, I do believe. Yes, there is. What time is that again? Oh, well, the metal art will be done by then, or at least they try to be. Do Thank you, Johnny show. Ray. So we have Johnny Ray at 15. Look at there, Paula. Getting all kinds of goodies for the show. Sweet. Whoop, whoop. Yep, yep, yep. You're going to wear your water rings? Okay. <laughs> big <laughs> shows, all of us amazing people giving all kinds of goodies away. That is and right. And then one big person every three months gets to win the whole ball of wax. Huh? Every three months? Yeah, you can only win once every three months. Well, right, but they give it away every time they're on. Right, but you can only win it once every three months. Hey, Daryl. Good to see you, buddy. Going twice. Did I say that right, Paula? Every three months, one person. Terry comes in and snipes at 16. Thank you, Terry. No, you did not say it right. <clears throat> so they give it away every time they have a big show, but you can only win once every three months as an individual. Hey, David Schacht, how are you, sir? Is it every three months or is it six months? David Schacht comes in at 18. Good to see you, David Schacht. Johnny Ray at 20. Thank you, Johnny Ray. Well, you know what, Oz? Terry is out. Thank you, Terry. You said it great, Diane. I can't keep it straight either. <laughs> you know what? What time? Oh, Paula, what time is that big show again? I can't remember. Is it 8.30 Sunday Eastern? I think. 8 or 8 or something like that. David Shack comes in at 22. I'd have to look. I don't remember. So well, Paula she'll post us. it. Yeah, you can post it. Yeah, so you want to go in and have some fun and look at some really cool coins that have come in through the coin community. And I don't know what else to do. I haven't been to a big show in forever or listened to one in forever. We got Peggy Hunts at 25 before you, Johnny Ray. Thank you, Peggy. Looking for Johnny. 26. Again, we have a 69 uncirculated U.S. mint set unopened. Um, and that's all I can tell you about that. And that's all you can tell. So you know what? It's kind of like penny roll. Yeah, one winner every other Sunday, 6.30 Pacific, 
Central, 9.30 Eastern. Thank Eastern, you, Paula. 9.30. Okay, so it'll be 8.30 our time. That's one winner right. every other Sunday. Okay. So we're at 25 with Peggy Hunts Everything. Thank you, Peggy. Last time I danced, a thunderstorm swooped in. I better give up dancing. <laughs> David checked us out. Thank you, David. I don't know. I get that, Oz. Maybe you had the rain dance going on, Oz. Johnny Ray, the highway man, <laughs> highway collector, comes back at. No worries, Paula. No worries. Comes back in at uh, $30. He said, enough of this. Right? Wow. Johnny Ray's at 30 looking for 31 What is up to you? What will you do? You bet, Paula. David, check this out. Peggy all is in, out. All done. Thank you, Peggy. Calling it down. Now it's last call. Here we go. We're going once. Going once. Not a week or twice. We'll say fair warning. So you're aware. <laughs> There's a sniper looking around. We're looking for 31. Are you ready? Oh, Johnny Ray. Oh, Johnny Ray. Johnny Ray. It's sold to you. Congratulations. Congratulations, Johnny, Johnny Ray. Thank you, buddy. Well, that was an interesting little ditty. Yeah, it was. One oh, of those rare moments. Singing? Huh? Stay safe out there on the road, buddy. I said, you're singing we were talking about? Or... Mm -hmm. I thought so. Interesting yep, yep, yep. ditty. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I got John Ray's little ticket up there. Hmm. Hmm, what? You got the right one? I always have the right one. I just I have it marked wrong, but that's all right. Next up, I have a 1964... This is silver proof Washington quarter. So is it a P? Yeah, well there's no mint mark, but yeah. Silver proof. And right, we have six dollars to open this. There we are. Six dollars on a sixty-four proof Washington quarter, ninety percent silver. Nice example here. Yeah, Peggy at eight. Sorry, Shaw. Just Peggy was in just before you. And boom, redneck Red comes, comes in. in. Hot and heavy. Go get it. Thank you, Red. Okay. Got that nice to it this way. Go get it. Go get it. You know you wanna win it. Go get it. So we got Peggy Hunts coming back at twelve. Whoop, whoop. Coming back in 12. We're looking for 13. Looking for 13. No, thanks, Shaw, though. <laughs> Redneck is ready to play there, Miss Peggy. Uh, Peggy. So Red comes in at 15. I'm looking for 16. Yes, Patriots mom, that is why we're live today in the afternoon. Otherwise, we would be, well, we normally would have been here at 2 o'clock today. It's but because Thursday. we have this fall extravaganza right. thing, and yes. we missed out last night, and uh, Coin Up had to do it because of the internet, we're doing a double header today. Today is Thursday, so this is not our normal day at all. We normally are. For this fall extravaganza, it is. Right. So we'll be on at 7 again tonight, too, Patriots mom. Eastern time. Peggy Hunts comes in at 20. So what do you think there? Thank Red you guys. Neck. What do you think? What do you think, Redneck? We're looking for 21, Peggy Hunts. Oh. Peggy Hunts. She's ready for you, bro. Yeah. She, oh, those look nice. Oh, I'm going to like that. That looks awfully large. Uh, that wow, that's huge. <laughs> mm. That's gonna look cool. You're gonna okay, some more sorry about that. that. Joe got distracted. He wanted to see our look shirts. at my coin op swag there, real quick. Well, yeah, Peggy Hunt says you want to. You said let's play, so she's playing there, redneck. What are you gonna do? It's up to you. Twenty-five. You can neuter the big dog. <laughs> <laughs> Red. Here we go. Bantering is on. Oh, boy, that's funny. Oh, you are. Well, we normally aren't on Thursday. This is just a rare week. 
Okay, Patriots mom. Peggy says uh, thirty dollars. You're up, big man. <laughs> no, you know I what? don't, Oz. But you know, I gotta, I gotta say stuff like that for, for this. I, I'll just leave that alone. Sorry. Oh boy, you guys. We have forty. <sighs> what you got now? Ooh, this smack talk between these people. You know what? Look at you started red. See, Paula, he's addicted. I'm <laughs> telling you. He's addicted. He's a, he just likes to smack talk and play tough. Hey, hey Shaw, don't worry. It's Peggy out of my comes league. in at 50. It's out of my league, too. They're just having fun now. This Peggy is... came in at 50. He's <laughs> your turn. <laughs> Guys, are you getting out of control? Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I bet you are, Peggy. If you do. <laughs> 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 Grab your pretzels and get your auction. We got an auction. <laughs> so unless really want it, Johnny Ray, my brother, help, help me out. Yeah, see, always calling the big brother. See, Thank Johnny you, Ray, like what he done? He can't keep up. Bigfoot feels like he's been beat up. <laughs> Peggy. Peggy sent. Uh... No asking for help. No, we don't have a help button. You know what is that? What is it? Call a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Peggy sent the big dog to the porch. Yeah. Well, yeah, Shaw, he does. We're going twice. They they want it way more than I do as well, Shaw. Right on. Hey, Fair Gregory, warning. how are you, sir? Fair warning. Daryl's here. Yay. Hey, Daryl. Gregory Arbuckle. I know. Wow is right. Yeah, the lifeline. Exactly, Floyd. Right. <laughs> so the Peggy hunts for fifty dollars. Congratulations you, and Red. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Leave him alone. He's up on the porch licking his wounds. <laughs> he went back with the tail between his legs. Maybe not the tail. <laughs> Thank you guys. We Thank you guys. That. Yes, we definitely appreciate it. And I don't know. I think you guys got a little crazy on that oh, one. Just... All in fun and bantering. That's humor. great. All right. Next up, I have a Blue Ike. You have a goodie. <laughs> 71. You're awesome. Oh. 71 Blue Ike. All the original government packaging. Peggy Hunt's measure is up to red. <laughs> and I'm looking for $10 on this. That's funny. So 71 Blue Ike, 40% silver. You wanted to go to a giveaway? All right, Peggy. Okay. Thank you, ma'am. All right. We'll you do guys that. are awesome. We appreciate that. Got it, Red. I don't know if we have Hopefully it. you uh you have the lucky letter, buddy. <laughs> right. Hi Rhonda, how are you, ma'am? Um Put it in a separate box. Thank you, Peggy. That's awesome. I don't know if we have a giveaway schedule today or Well, not. we're going to do one now. Okay. Cool. A generous bully. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. So we have an interest at the, on the 71. Hey, G-Dub. Blue Ike. Hey, G-Dub. Fox Run is here. Hey, Fox Run. And here I was going to give it to Peggy. And here she was going to give it away. That would have been funny, eh? A, right on. Eh? <laughs> we're doing well, Rhonda. Thank Rhonda's you. Rhonda's here. Thank you, Rhonda, for coming. So where are we at, Oz? Who's going strong here? Nobody. We have no bid on the 71 Blue Ike. Looking for $10 on this Blue Ike. Any interest? Or we'll just pull her down. Excuse me. Yeah. Cool. No interest at $10. I see RC Pops is here. Hey, RC Pops. You are Pops. there. Hello. Yes, we are here. There's Robert Lawson. Hey, Robert. How are you, sir? Florida is helping Madam Sue and doing some food shopping. And we'll be here as soon as she finishes. And now I have to pick her up. Good. Okay. Thanks for coming in. We'll see you when you get back. Thank you, Robert. Yeah. Thank you, Robert. We got Paula Bloom at 10. Thank you, Paula. This is to I the think, giveaway. If I'm not mistaken, I think. Ten dollars is about melt on these. I thought is, but I have to catch the door. All right. 
I hope it's not very heavy. Hello. Thank you. All right. Let's see. We have Paula at 10. Nobody else interested? Um, I'm just looking here real quick. Calculate. All right. Well, uh, now about 860 is melt, I guess. Thank you, Paula. Take care, Robert. Be safe out there. All right, so we have a 71 blue white case of spam. <laughs> oh, Paul. Congratulations, Paula. That's sold to you for $10. Nice pickup. Get that put back in there, Paula. Very cool. We got three packages from FedEx, two from Ross. One for Gary, one for you and me. Oh. All right, so who won that one? This what is the one there? from the U.S. Mint. Is it? Look at this. That's from the U.S. Mint? That's from the freaking U.S. Mint. That's just lovely. And it rattles. That kind of ticks me off. I'm sure if everything is fine, but what the heck? Anyway. So this was sold to Paula? Yes, Paula for $10. Okay, thank you. All right, I'm going to put up the next one. And I love getting one. packages from my kiddo now. I wonder what it's about. All right. Thank you, Movado. So that was the blue white that we got for ten dollars. Yep. Congratulations, Paula. All right, now we're gonna go back to uh, we have a 1904 barber quarter, and this one, of course, has a bunch of goofy. Look at here, this one's to Shirley Buckler. Oh, looky there, we got Shaw Six. 1904 barber quarter. That's FedEx, Paula. <laughs> yep, FedEx. Mm. And with love from mother. Hmm. Oh. From mother. From mother. And that's what we have up. 1904 Barber Quarter. This also looks like it has some hairlines on it. So keep that in mind when you're bidding. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Roman, how are you, sir? Mr. Roman. Wait for it. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Mr. Roman. All right, there. Okay. Promise fulfilled. There. <laughs> we keep our word here on Joe Durbin channel. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Work with me. Now you got it all messed up. Mr. Roman came in at 8. Dove season comes in at 8.50. Thank you, guys. Red next star comes in at 10. There. So, not only do you get this 1904 Barber Quarter, but you get all that <laughs> lovely graffiti on the slap, the That's flip. You get the I Love You, Shirley from Mama from 1985. What a great thing. Isn't this a neat history thingy? I don't know. I kind of like this. Paula. Thank you. All uh, the stuff on there. Thank you, Dove Season. Right on, Mr. Roman. Hello to you. I hope you're having a good day today. Terry comes in at 11. Oh, boy, Miss uh, Patriot's mom. I understand that. So we got Terry at 11, looking for 12. <laughs> Mr. Roman, yes. <laughs> <laughs> We got Redneck at 15. Redneck, Thank you, you Red. like package, packages coming from us because you get M&Ms. Right. There you go, Red. With, <laughs> you got to see that? <laughs> with love from Mother Red, if you happen to win that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jonathan Reese, how are you? <coughs> Excuse me. Good to see you, buddy. You know, you can only try there, Shaw. You just never know. You just keep trying. <laughs> so who's who do we, Terry's out. 
because Redneck is at 15. So we have a few of them. So we're looking for 16 going ones. Hey, Jonathan. A few of them birthier sets in here for the new babies. And M&Ms in, for in the mommy. <laughs> Redneck. Yeah. Brian and Heather. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Those are cute. Yeah, I can't wait to get into them. Sold right. to Red for 15. Congratulations, Red. Thank you, buddy. Let's see, do I have one for Red going right now? Uh, red is look at that quick. Okay. When you're done. Sold to Red. $15. Redneck medals for $15. Send to Mr. Send this to Mr. Roman, please. Absolutely. Thank you, Mr. Roman. Or congratulations, Mr. Roman. Thank you, Red. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Red. And thank you, bidders, to Mr. Roman. Mr. Roman. Mr. Congratulations, Mr. Roman. Oh, this is the Casey board? Okay. No, that's, I wanted to, that's something completely different. That's not for. No, 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 no. Yeah, the one is just the box, but flip it over. There you go. See how you can. Isn't <laughs> this that is cool? adorable. All good. Uh, no worries, uh, Re uh, Les. This is so cute. What happened? I'm just. Ready. Oh, you're you, you're all good there, Les. Oh, okay. It'd Sorry be cool to that. find the original owner. Yeah, it would be. You know what? And I keep wondering. I wonder if those people live in this area. The name know. sounds familiar, but we're not. I don't know all those people in this spot. This is this is cool. Right. <laughs> this needs to go to uh, Heather. No. Oh, you sent it to Brian's baby. No. Oh. That's okay. A, these are. It's for them. Oh. Sorry, guys. All right. Next up, I have six forty percent silver half dollars. Probably should. Stay focused. 1965. 1966. Well, I should show you the reverses as well. So 65 and 66. And of course, here's a 67. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Wait. yeah. No, but I take that back. There's five of them here. Because I had two 67s. That one I'm throwing out. And then we have a 68. So we got Paul Hampton at 15, jump season coming and in at 69. So five 40 percent halves. I could probably find another one, but five 40 percent silver halves, one money. Oh, that sounded lovely. Um, very nice, very nice, very nice. So we got Paul Hampton at 17. Thank you, Paul. After Johnny Ray came in, Johnny Ray, you need to refresh, my love. What's wrong with Johnny? Johnny, Johnny Ray, you need to refresh, buddy. Let's see where are we at here. We got Dove season at sixteen, and Paul Hampton at seventeen. Dove season comes back at eighteen. Oh, maybe you meant to put a one, Johnny Ray. You need nineteen to stay in it to win it. All right, you know what? <laughs> Show off the 65 some more mud swat. Okay, let's see what we can do. We got. I'm going to add this first. 20. Yeah, wait. Before you guys are done bidding, 1970 Denver. Still in the mint cello. Still in the mint So now we have cello. six. There's the 65. It has, it's, it's close to cameo, but no cameo. Okay, Red, then you don't need those. Okay. Peggy Hunts comes in at 25. So, yes, I threw the uh, 1970 in there. So, you have 65 through 70. All 40 percenters. You have the run of 40 percenters. Paul there. Hampton at 30. Thank you, Paul. And there is the 70. Denver. So, Paul Hampton's at 30. We're looking for 31. What will you do, all bidders? Dove Season says he's out. Thank you, Dove Season. Where's Buzz? He's buzzed somewhere. <laughs> Peggy Hunt is out Just to buzzing Paul. Around. 
Just buzzing around. Buzz, 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 buzz. buzz. I better write that down. I'm missing some of this stuff. Today's the third. So we got red coming in at 31. Oh, see? You went and looked, didn't you, red? Hmm. 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 I guess you do need that one, huh? <laughs> <laughs> well, I watched the video. You watched the video. I did. The video? The video. Oh, of his uh, collections? He showed his half dollars. Ah, I see. So we're going twice? Nah, I'm only looking for two so I can compete at the full row. Okay. Right on, Johnny. Oh, is this going to go to red? So we have red at 31. Paul's and he out won. and sold to red. He won that bid. Thanks, bidders. Congratulations, red. You Thank got, you, red. You got your one that you needed to fill and then some. Floyd says, no, Paul, keep going. <laughs> That's right, Paul, uh, Floyd. I mean, Floyd. The Commission man. check will be in the mail. In the mail. Congratulations, Woody. Thank you, Brad. I mean, Fred. Red. Red. Red, red, red. Dang, Nabbit. Blasted rock star. Okay. That was 31, right? 31 to red. Yep, yep, yep. Next up. I have a... I have a... Where is my list? Right here. 1965. I got it. Special mint set. And we have nine dollars to open this. This is open, and let's see here. Get them out of there. You get all your government packaging, but let's see. You got your forty percent half, your quarter, nickel, dime. And your scent. So again, this is a 65 special mint set. Thank you, Shaw. Peggy hunts everything come in hot and heavy at $15 on this 1965 SMS set. Came in at 15 after, oh, and then Shaw said nine. Okay, Shaw. Thank you, Shaw. Might need to refresh his CAD. The obverse there looks, has a little funky going on on that half. <laughs> Paul, he's not a meanie. He's just selective. <laughs> but I still got room in your box. Yes, oh, you yeah, do. you do, Red. Yes, you do, Red. It's Working a spam it. conspiracy. <laughs> it is. It's all about spam, right? Oh, Polly, I'm not a meanie. Especially not to you, but no one wants 65 SMS set going once. Where's my bell? Going twice. And fair warning, fair warning. Oh, Diane, what will you do? I will scream and shout, dance all about. That's what I'll do. Sweet. Can I watch? <laughs> Peggy for 15. Congratulations, Peggy. Congratulations, Peggy. I got five more sheets. Oh my goodness, there's so much going on here. I can give you some tips if you need. Just saying. What kind of tips? I'm, I'm singing and dancing. Oh, yeah, you. Uh huh. Yeah, okay. Say what, Red? Did you bid, Red? Oh, 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 oh. Hang, on. hang on. Sorry about that right there. Going twice, Red. Well, 16 then, and then sold. Sorry, Peggy. I see that, Red. I didn't see it till you said something. Oh, I didn't see that either. We just missed it. Sorry. So that is not sold yet. So we have Red at 16. Um, Looking for 17. Let me, let me look at something. 
Sometimes that's a little, con wait, 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 I sniped, you did snipe, you did snipe there, red, redneck, you did. Look at you. No, so red says 16, looking for 17, what? Let's just uh, go sold on them, Oz. I have two of them red, I'll just give you one and Peggy one, both at 15, if that works. Peggy and red? Yeah, here's the other one red. Is that okay? Do you want that? Go bin 15 if you want it. <coughs> Red. Sounds great, he says. And Peggy, are you good with that as well? Thank you, Red. Here you go, Dan. And need a bag for that. I'm looking. She says yes. Thank okay, you, good. Baby. Congratulations, both of you. There, that solved that dilemma. Everybody gets some. Whoop, whoop. Sweet. Thank you, guys. This one is Peggy. After much thought and deliberation, I stand corrected. I was wrong. Peggy hunts everything, is not a bully. But does have a sadistic streak. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bigfoot, you crack me up, brother. You are just a jewel. I just want a penny penny from it. Want a penny from it. Oh well. Then Here share it amongst your friends. <laughs> congratulations, right. both you guys. Yeah, congrats. Thank you. All right, next up. I have the uh, 2015 Denver's, the clad U.S. Marshall's commemorative half dollar, and $15 is opening on this. So here's your outer, here's your inner box. You have your pertinent information card. Outer and inner. And, oh, that's upside down. The red neck of 15. Opening that wide open with that one. 2015. This is the U.S. Marshals commemorative half dollar. Pretty cool design on here. If you ask me, there's We the People. You have uh, the Marshals badge, Liberty holding the. Uh, yeah. So far today, Shaw. But Johnny Ray hasn't bid yet. Oh, Johnny Ray, I got something in the mail for you. He knows. It's awesome. So, so there we go. Then. And uh, this is the 20, is this, yeah, 2014. Sorry about that. I'm a little, there so, we go. 2014 Denver. Oz, you're bidding? Okay. Thank you. So we got Redneck at 17. Thanks, Oz. Uh -huh. Sorry. What's, I'm sorry. I should have paid attention. She's wandering around. Wrong channel for me then? Huh? No, it's not the wrong channel, Shaw. You just gotta try. <laughs> you know, not ever. It, it, anyway, I don't know what to say. So we have red at seventeen. Thanks, Oz. Sorry about Wasn't that. Wasn't planning on it, but liked it. Oh, okay, it's all good. All right, we got. Hey, red Shane. At 17. How are you, buddy? Hey, Shane. Yeah, red is just a puppy. You're right. He needs his uh, M and M's from his mommy. One thing. <laughs> one thing about red, he's just not anything. <laughs> <laughs> so we got red at 17. Red is holding it at 17. <laughs> red is holding at 17. Red, yellow. Uh, Looking for time. 18. All in, all done. Oz is out, but Terry comes in. Thank you, Terry. Are you paying attention to that Oz bit on that? Because it's cool. Right. That's what he did. Just saying. Well, I was paying attention because I thanked him and said sorry I missed your bid and caramel M and M's. No, he just liked the peanut M and M's. Red comes in at twenty. No, we throw the caramel M and M's at the wrong, at the people in front of us. No, like they come to me. <laughs> they come to me. There's a rich. Yeah. Oh, Polly, that's funny. Shaw. Terry's at 21. Thank you, Terry.
We got Terry at 21. No, they did not, Johnny Ray. They made a uh, commemorative dollar similar. The only commemorative half dollars were the 82 George Washington and the 93 James Madison. Red is out because Terry Knopf Singer is holding strong at 21. And we're going once. We're going once, we're going once, going once. Going twice. Now we're going twice. You have to go, Paula. Take care, Paula. Thank you so much. For Thank you, Paula, so much for coming in and appreciating. Congratulations on your bids. And yes. look all the treasures you get to take home. Wow. Sending it all off to you. Big show in you. Uh -huh. Take care, the Paula. Big show in you. So we're going to have to check out the big show. Because, you know. Yes, ma'am. That's we what I am get saying. We'll there this Sunday, but next time. When they come back at 22. Polly, that's exactly what I'm saying is, yeah. Red can be bought with a bag of peanut and M&Ms. <laughs> How yeah. big of a bag, though, is the question. That's the key factor right there. Terry's Don't out. Don't send this little envelope shape. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Terry. We send them the big five pounder. Except I'm going to have to talk to your wife so it can be rationed because you sit down and eat a whole big five pound bag in one city and I have to watch you. Hush, hush, honey. <laughs> <coughs> Maybe, you. Paul. Send some. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going twice, once to red. We're looking for 23. <laughs> all in, all done. Going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. You and me both, Bigfoot. Yep, they do dove, dove season. I like the caramel, though. Sold to Red. Congrats, Red. Thank you, buddy. For 22. Now, let's send this to Peggy, please, for being such a good sport. Okay, you got it. Absolutely, Red. Thank you, Red. 22 to Peggy. Congratulations, Peggy. This is coming to you, ma'am. See how that works? He's just a rock star. Yeah, a rock star without a microphone. Go figure. <laughs> Two Peggy hunts. So everything. that's lot 13. Congrats, Peggy. Thank you, Red. You're awesome, buddy. I'm Red. Okay. And here we go. Be careful not to smear the ink. Ugh. Oh, I touched it too, didn't I, huh? It'll dry in just a second. Okay, next up, I have. Let's see, I have the United States Silver Dollars. And inside there is United States Olympic Coins, 1984. Now you're going to get all this pertinent information. I'll put that over there. And you get this lovely little velvet box. And inside... We have a 1983 San Francisco Olympic and a 1984 Olympic. The 84 has a little bit of haziness on it. On the obverse, it's kind of, <coughs> kind of changing there. And there's the reverse, or that's the obverse anyway. There's mm, your 84 and 83. We have Shane at 41. Let me flip this other one. And that one has, yeah, it has the eagle reverse. Hey, Mad Stacker, how are you? So that's what we have up, 83 and 84 commemorative dollars, silver dollars. These are 90% silver. And they're commemorating the uh, 19, well, they're commemorating the 84 Olympic Games. And 45. Have, thank you guys for your bids. I have Shane at <laughs> 41 and Red, Red at 45. 40. Daddy, go have your nap. Ah. Ah. <laughs> I'll do that giveaway thing. That was an extra one. You know what I mean? Later on. Thank you. 
Oh, where's my giveaway? Shoot. All right, I got red at 45. Matt you, Stacker's here. How are you doing today, Matt Stacker? Red's at 45. Calling her down, going Number once. 46. And Shane comes in at 46, Red. Was you even born there? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not there. Ouch, that had to hurt. <laughs> Was you even born then? Then? Is that what it said? Mm -hmm. Oh. That's funny. He may have been, but just a little guy. Just a little body. Hey, ha ha, how are you? It's great to see you. Thanks, buddy, for your for uh, coming in and coming and hanging out at Coin Ops last night. You're awesome. We appreciate you. This is the giveaway. Okay. It's the giveaway box. So this is another one is what you're telling me? Yeah. Yeah. Did you say Ross? No. <laughs> Your mom is here. That's who I was talking to. Um. 47. I'm not vintage like you, Dad. Ah -ha! Red. That's I don't fun. know. Come on, Shane. Let him have it. I know you got one more wise crack in you. Thank you, haha. -ha. That was awfully nice of you. I appreciate you. Okay, where are we at? Red's at 47, looking for 48. Running around like a crazy woman. Can I to catch up on chat? I'm not vintage like you. Shane <laughs> says I'm out. All right, Red. Thank you, Shane. Have it your own way. Okay. Shane says I'll teach that boy. <laughs> so we're going once. We're going twice. Going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. I know you're going to get this soul to Redneck. Congrats, Red. To Redneck. <laughs> Very nice, I want buddy. To spend your old age money. Whoa! <laughs> kind of like borderline disrespectful, there, little boy. <laughs> who, who are you talking to? Wow, Red. There's no disrespect there. That's all love. In bantering in the auction, right? That's right. <laughs> you had big brothers. You know how it goes. Oh, I've had five, so yeah. Congratulations, Red. A lot is at fourteen. Congrats, Red. Thanks, brother. Here you are. Oh, that's a beautiful one, too. Very nice. Are you trying to fill up your box there, Red? Okay. So we can ship it Monday? Perfect. Perfect. All right. Now, I have one more of these uh, it's getting antsy. lovely little barber quarters okay. with, with the love notes on them. I don't have m ms to ship yet, so you're this is. Patient. An 1899 Billy Barber Corden. This is to Shirley, of course. Of course. Shirley Buckler, love mother. Oh, my. My love for so mother. So now we have three kids or three people in this story. No, nope, two. Well, three, yes. The last two coins were from mother to Shirley, and the first one was for to the hubby. Yes. And we have Dove Season at $6. Thank you, Dove Season. And that's what we have up next is the 18. 99 Billy. Okay, I'm gonna fill in my sheet. Hi ho, silver comes in at Hi seven dollars. Comes in at seven dollars. I know what hi ho is up to. Interesting. He's up to about five foot eight. I have no clue. Maybe you just never know. Anyway, enough of that silliness. Oh. So we have high hole holding at eight dollars. She surely did love her daughter. Ha <laughs> that's funny. Okay. She did indeed. She did indeed. High hole is holding strong on this motherly love. Eighteen ninety nine. Out. Thank you, Dove Season. Got this holding strong at eight. That was a lot of money to get back in the day. You know what? Last year, right? Well, nineteen eighty five. Nineteen eighty three. It was probably a little over a quarter. Looking for eight fifty or nine over a quarter. Nineteen eight. Oh, that one was eighty three. That first one was eighty five. I thought maybe I was yeah. wrong. Eighty five. 
the so they gave away coins as gifts mm. only the ones they wanted it was real money last yep, that's right that is Floyd. right so i think we have high hole going strong high going hole twice. at eight dollars going twice we're Fair bringing warning. the silver bell for the man down under and it's friday for him let's have a little copper sold a high hole for eight dollars congratulations high hole hi ho oops whoa hi ho better get down into my range thank you hi ho cared enough to save that from the great melt i mean to tell you which one i got it so let's go into hi ho for eight dollars congratulations hi ho thank you bidders hi -ho. that's very very cool thank you sir we're gonna ship we will it get off that in your here. package yeah, you got a package being shipped. Here you are, honey. So perfect. Nah, it's the way it's in the flip, Oz. That add to the pack for Paula. Okay. To oh, high hole or to okay. Paula. To Paula. Big show. You want it to Paula or to the big show? Because I'll put that on her um, packing slip. Hi, ho. Big show or Paula directly? Paula. Okay, you got it. Thank you, buddy. Congrats, Paula. All right. So that was lot 15 for $8. You guys are awesome. That's to like Paula. One, two, three, four. All right. To Paula. Five out of the first 15 items were given away. That's you what guys. an awesome bunch of people. Well, look at here. Yeah. Shirley was just a giving lady. Oh, this Shirley got this set. Oh, it was given to her? This Interesting. is Shirley from Mother, 1961 Silver Proof Set. And I'm going to get these out of here. Mother wow. was happy, was nice enough to leave us with all the government packaging. <clears throat> and we have a nice problem-free Silver Proof Set here. There's your Benji. That is on the flip, or on the cello. It moves. So there's your three silver coins, your half, quarter, and dime. And you have. She was, Oz. That's Shirley. She was a sweetheart. You have the Jefferson Nickel. <coughs> the bright red Lincoln Memorial Scent. And Peggy is at $28. Thank you, Peggy. Oh, sure. We are just seconds past. Peggy was first at 28. We're looking for 29. Thank you, guys, uh, Peggy and Cheryl, for your bids. And again, this is on the cell of the marks you see in front of Franklin's face there. And that cap, let me look at the reverse. Uh, uh, maybe. He is, but differently. That, Cheryl comes in at 29, Peggy at 30. Thank you, guys. That half may get cameo. It wouldn't get deep cameo for sure, but it, it has light cameo on obverse and reverse. Ah, I don't, I don't know, maybe. But anyway, that's what we have up. It's uh, 1961 silver proof set. There's your quarter. Yeah. Okay, something's in the air. It's drying out my nose. We're looking for 31. Thank Peggy you, Peggy. Hots at 30. Right on, Shaw. It is a dream set. Oh, I don't know. I'd go way older for a dream set myself so cheryl comes back at 31. and fred comes in yeah 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 <laughs> how you doing there sweet cheeks <laughs> fred carson thank my you cheryl. darling how are you peggy hunts us out thank you peggy out to shirley thank you yep, she is um conceding to cheryl shirley's gonna get shirley's So we're going once. You don't have to get mad at me. I'm done with you. All right. <laughs> I'm easy. Ask Oz. <laughs> going once to Sheryl. Oklahoma. Utah. <laughs> going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. Are you leaving, Daryl? Thank you for coming in. appreciate you coming in. Take care, Daryl. It's good to see you, buddy. It jinked your interest? 
internet. Oh, you jinxed my. We did not jinx your internet. We didn't touch your internet. They cut our line. Congratulations. I did it. I did it. Okay, Trust I'll me. get it read. That so that went to Cheryl for thirty-one. Sold to Cheryl for thirty-one. Thank you, Cheryl. Congratulations, Cheryl. Thank you, bidders. Very nice. 1961 silver set to Cheryl. And that is lot 16. Yes, ma'am. For 15. Very cool. Cheryl, do not include no, that is shipping. Not, you have free shipping right now. That is not for $15. No. $31. What in the world? Sorry. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, Cheryl, did you hear me? You have a credit on shipping. Okay. You need a 58. Mm. Well, a lot. Number 25 just happens to be a 58. Fred. Oh, we've been talking about this all day so far. And what do we have? A 1982 90% silver commemorative half. This is the proof. And looky there. There's old handsome George himself. 250th anniversary of the birth. George Washington. The reverse has, um, I don't know what that is. I think that's George's house. Let's see. I had Dove season at 13, and Peggy comes in at $20. Thank you, Peggy. So we have Peggy at $20. Let me flip this again. And this is on the George Washington proof commemorative half dollar, 90% silver. Very nice. Very nice. Um, I'm sorry, Fred. We don't get that, that, that easy for me to say. Peggy Hunt's at 20. That's right, uh, Red. We are here just to enjoy ourselves. That's right. Our bidders are going to Thank enjoy, you, enjoy season. yourselves. You're, yeah, well, I wanted you to make sure you remembered, Cheryl. So, yeah, don't put the shipping in this time. He's in your ancestry. That's right, Fred Carson. We shared that before, didn't we? Um, I got to go to over here. So, where are we at? We have Peggy Hunts at 20, looking for 21, going twice. Are you having a good time, Cheryl? Good. I'm glad. Sold a Peggy Thank for $20. You, Peggy. Congratulations. Congratulations, Peggy. We're having a blast. We're having a blast in here. We're having a blast. $20 to Peggy. This lot 17 is going to you, Peggy. Thank you very much. Thank you, Peggy. Please send that to Red Snack Stacker. Congrats, Red. To Thank Red you, Peggy. Nick. To Red. You got it. <laughs> you guys are see how you guys very are. Very kind. Man, this just keeps going and going and going. All right. Next up, I have a special mint set. <laughs> Good with an axe. And this is a 1966. Now, let me get this out of here and we'll see what we got. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 1966 special mint set. Now, I haven't looked at this set. I take that back. I looked at the dime to see if it had a, a uh, five on the cheek. And that's all I looked at. So, the half may have varieties on it yet. I do not know. The dime may have varieties other than the, dime, the five on the cheek. That is all I looked for. And I have red at 18. This is, Diane, this is the wrong one. 
this is a nine dollar opening bid and this is a 66 special mint set i'll put up the right item and then we will continue it's so pretty so Brad, delete your bid we're starting over. This is the 1966 special mint set. Did I put the wrong one up? Yes. Sure did. Sorry, guys. 1966 special mint set. Opening bid is nine dollars. Starting over. Apologize for the mistake there. And yeah, I have read at nine dollars. I like it. Get what you paid for <laughs> with help, you know. <laughs> I have red at nine dollars. Rich H came in at nine as well, looking for nine fifty or ten. Rich. Hey, Flag City, how are you? How are you doing today, Jeff? Sirig comes in at ten. Hello, Sirig. Hey, Sirig. Okay, Fox Run. Todd Miller, come. Todd Miller, hey, good Todd. to see you. Oh, that's what I was gonna look for. Uh, okay. We're looking for 11. Surig's at 10. Looking for 11. Oh, that's. So Rich H, if you still bright. want to bid, we're looking for 11. Todd, 11. Either one of y'all. Makes no never mind to me. Rich and H comes in at 11. Yes. Peggy Hunts comes in at 13. Looking for 14 now, guys. Thank you guys. How are you doing, Todd? I got your stickers, buddy. Thank you very much. We'll be doing a, a little mail call video here shortly. And uh, we have a bunch of shout outs too. Rich H is out. And Todd Miller at 11, but Peggy's at 13. Sorry, Peggy. Thank you, Sir Egg. Todd. All right. <sighs> Let's see. Todd Miller comes back at 15. Yes, he does. Boom. I'm not gonna... Right on, Red. Thank you, Red. I, I messaged you back. Peggy is out. Thank you, Peggy, for your bid. We got Todd at 15, looking for 16. Peggy is out. Thank you, Peggy. Rich H is out, too. Thank you, Rich. Thank you, Rich. So who we got in this? Is it just Todd holding strong? Then we're all in all done, huh? Yeah, it's good to see. Oh, yep, Sirik is out. We're all in all done. Going once. Going once. We're going once. We're going twice. Uh-huh. Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, what will you do? Todd Miller, a sniper could be coming after you. You never know. Oh, sold but it's sold to, to you for $15. Thank you, Todd. Congratulations, Congratulations. Todd. Congratulations. Thank you, bidders. Appreciate your bids. That will be coming to you, Todd. Todd yes, Moore. sir. Uh, Flag City, Jeff, we are. We'll be doing... An Double auction, header today. An auction again at 7 p.m. Central. Thank you, Todd. Oh, is Todd Grandpa red? Okay. That's funny. Okay, Todd Grandpa. <laughs> we have these uh, adopted families in this YouTube channel. And okay, Gregory. Look, somebody new I got to be connected to. <laughs> Take care, Greg Arbuckle. Are you leaving? Have a great night. See you later. Hopefully, enjoy your dinner. Is it that time already? Goodness. All right. Next up, I have a pair of commemorative clad half dollars. Now the, we're going to put that one up. The first one is the Columbus, 1992 Columbus. This is the San Francisco proof. And this one does have some haziness on it. 
haziness. Yes, but the flip is also a little scuffed up. And then we have the uh, 91 Mount Rushmore commemorative half dollar. Again, San Francisco Mint. He really is your grandpa? That's cool. Fred, Fred Carson comes in at 18. And there's your reverse. The golden anniversary. Thank you, uh, Fred. Okay, I'm going to do this. So that's what we have a pair of commemorative half dollars, 91 and a 92, the Christopher Columbus and the uh, Yellowstone. No, Mount Rushmore, excuse me. We're looking for 19. We have the lovely and talented Fred Carson at $18. Lovely and talented. <laughs> Let me see here. All righty. So we're at 18, looking for 19. If we're all in, all done, we'll just fall going these down. once. There we go. What am I doing? I'll not leave them alone. Going once. And Sir Egg comes in. Snipes it at 19. Sir Egg the sniper comes in at 19. Thank you, Sir Egg. So we have Surrey at $19 on this pair of commemorative half dollars. And Fred, the lovely and talented Fred Carson comes back at 20. <laughs> Thank you, Fred. We appreciate you. Appreciate you. Uh... So Fred comes back in at 20, huh? Look over 21 now. Welcome back, Roadrunner. Thank you, Fred. We have Fred at 20. Sirig is out. Thank you, Sirig, Thank for your you, bid. Sirig. So we're going once. Going once to We are Fred going Carson. once, going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. We are going once. Now we're going twice. Fair <laughs> warning. So to Fred Carson. Fred Carson. Sold to Fred for $20. Congratulations, Fred. Thank you, Fred. Thank, Thank you, Fred. bidders. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sir Rig. You will get these in your basket, Fred. Fred Carson. $20 to you. Congratulations. Here you are, Diane. Thank you. I think I do. Well, I don't know where Mooney is, but... Well, is this it? Too bad for him, I guess. wonder if he's lurking. Uh, he had to work today. He didn't know if he'd make it to the... So I picked this up for Mooney. Nope, he's not here. And actually, I got this, I believe, from Peggy Hunts Everything at one of their auctions. And this is the uh, uh, 2016 Somalia... 100 shilling. All right, Flag City. Thank um, you. And it's the elephant, three nines fine elephant round. You did, she said. So we are opening this up at $40. I thought Mooney would be here. I'm going to take it out of this bag. There we go. And of course, he's not. So if anybody's interested in that, this is a proof, and Happy Paul Hampton says, I like elephants. I'm a pachyderm person. There we go. Thank you, Paul. So we have Paul at $40. Paul Hampton at 40 Oh, it's four nines. Very cool, Jonathan Reese. Very cool. Of course. That's who I got it for, and he never showed up. Right. Well, then how do we keep up? I think it's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy. Okay, since we're doing conspiracy thoughts, okay. Well, I would have gave it to him, but I gave him some other coins, and I forgot this one, and then I found it. And then you found it? Mm-hmm. Hmm. And so he asked if there's any pachyderms coming up, and I said no, but I will put one up next week. And here, and here it is. It is. 
Yep. So it is. I understand what he's up to now. He's trying to get somebody to buy it for him. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> we got Paul Hampton at 40. Going Thank twice. You, Paul. Going once, going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. This coin is going home. Sold to Paul Hampton. To Paul Hampton. Congrats, Paul. Congrats, Paul. Mad Stacker loves smallies. I, the smallie right. coins, yes. Right on. For $40, right, Paul? Paul Hampton, yes. Congrats, Paul. Thank you, sir. Wonderful. Be careful of them. I'll just may uh, eat spam. I'm not sure. <laughs> they just might. Put it in your act, act, auction, action, auction for him next week if he shows up. Well, Paul doesn't do auctions, but, or hasn't, but that was lot number 20. He is. And it was $40, right? Ah, he's, Paul says, thank you. Please send this to Paul Hampton. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, Paul. <laughs> All right. Next up. <laughs> you cracked me up, Paul. Yeah. Next up, I have a 64 Kennedy. And this is 90% silver. And it has a clip right there at the 6. And the date. And let me show you right there on the S of states and the O of of. And we're looking for $20 to open this up. A 1964 silver Kennedy half dollar with a clip planchet. I'll try to show that. There we go. So there's your clip. And I believe, yes, you can see a little of the Blakely effect on top there between the B and the E. The rim gets a little, little wider. It should show up. Not all the time they'll have it, but directly across from the clip will be the Blakely effect. And you should, that extra metal has to flow somewhere. Yes, you see down there by the F. Oh, the F, look at that. The rim gets a little fatter. That is what they call the Blakely effect. A nibble, not a clip. Thanks, Roadrunner. Okay. <laughs> well, if you were to have that same size clip on a Lincoln cent or a Merc, uh, dime, then you would think that's a clip. So it's a clip. Just it's on a larger coin. But so I get what you're saying. It is twenty dollars. And the larger the coins get, the harder it is to find clips on them because they stand out so bad. Well, oh, sorry, hi ho, he lost his internet. No, interest when Hidden was in here. He said I was going to bid on that. For oh, him, the packeter. Interest. I, I got it. He lost interest when Hidden. I get it. I thought he said internet. Because he's not here. Yep. Right on, hi ho. So, do we have any interest in this 1964 um, Kennedy half? Yeah, 49 cents. To me, <laughs> Floyd, looks like 49 cents to you um, rather than 50. Oh, because of that clip <laughs> with the clip planchet. Yeah, if they took a, a cent off of it. Like I said, the larger the coin gets, the harder it is to find clips because they are pulled out right away because they stand out. And if we can just start calling, you know, Paul Hampton at 20. Oh, thank you, Paul. Thank I you, Paul. I appreciate that. You felt safe you could bid with Hidden. Oh, I understand that. Of he course. Wasn't here. Well, of course. Too I bad. bid against him all the time. <laughs> I would elaborate, but he's not here to defend himself, so I won't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so we're looking for 21. Going once. Going. Going once. Talk to you later, Shaw's prospecting. Thank you for coming. Take care, Shaw. Going twice. I have an elephant keychain. You can't have too much good luck. Oh, that's right. That's awesome, hi ho. No. Uh, Paul. <laughs> you are so, don't even talk that way. 
sold to Paul. Paul Hampton. At $20. $20, not $40. That was last time. <laughs> Thank you, Paul. Oops. Because he bid 20 and opening bid was 20. Yeah. Alrighty. Paul Hampton again. Congratulations, Mr. Hampton, the spaminator himself. Oz, it was twenty dollars, honey. That's all good. And that's lot twenty-one. Got an extra room for you, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Next up, I have a silver round, and this is the Buffalo. Ooh, this is twenty-five dollars, not twenty-eight. That's my typo, but I know that happens to me when I enter names in that thing. It just goes. I get it. And this is two thousand and five Indian Head Buffalo, one ounce, three nines fine silver round. An opening bid. It's twenty-five on this one. I had a typo. Yeah. Because it was cloudy. No, he's copying. He copied. You know, it does automatic. Right. Oh, you had a typo? Right. And so I said the opening bid is 25. Oh. Which is under spot. Thank you. I have Dove Season at 25. All right. I'll fix Thank that. you, Dove Season. Just you can delete it. It's, it doesn't need to go any further because we have bids. Hi, Megan. How are you today, ma'am? Megan's here. Good to see you, girl. And Thank you for coming. The reverse. He's kind of a squirrely eyed looking buffalo, isn't he? Dove season is at 27. 27. How much is shipping between $355 and $8, depending on how much you buy? In the United States. Yes, in the U.S. Outside of the U.S., well, that depends on the weight and the package and the this and the that. Thank you, Dove season. Now, the scratch, the scuffs are on the the air type but that haziness is on the round and just wanted to clear that up Duh, megan is at 30 dove season is out thank you thank you dove <laughs> excuse me um oh, so good um, to see you megan i'm glad you made it again today sorry about yesterday i hope that wasn't too confusing it just isn't worth a headache what hello uh Hello, hello again. Oh, hello. sorry, Jonathan. I didn't see your comment there, but thank you for uh, thank you for that, Terry. Yeah, it was two thousand and one, the commemorative on the buffaloes. This is just a generic round, though. Thank you, Les. Boom, boom. Well, I gotta get over here. Oh. So we got, we're going twice. No worries. Less, we don't worry about oh, that. Oh, we don't have major rules. We can tell. Hi Ho's um, at 31. So, no. Hi Ho's you, hi -ho. sniped Megan at 31. So we have a Hi Ho at 31. So it's not sold to Megan yet. Hi Ho at 31. Looking for 32, Megan. An that engine. was a nice night. Yeah. An engine's got some uh, hair loss problems, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he's grown a beard, a little goatee. <laughs> that was a good hot snipe, hi ho. Hi -ho. I saw the soul post 32. She said, I know. You know, sometimes I can show you right here. Before he can get there. Going twice and then hi ho, right above the soul, hi ho got in. Sorry, Megan. You see that? Going twice and then. Hi ho with 31. That's what I see. That's all I have to go by mine. She said she saw this. Oh, no, I'm just never that mind. Way, that way, we're all on the same page. There's and definitely she no you. thank you, Megan. <laughs> That's why she bid 32. Whoop, whoop. Whoop. He beat you on your screen, too. I know. Oh, hi ho is out. Oh, thank you. Hi ho. Thank you. Hi ho. So we are now going and calling this baby down, going once, all in all done. Going twice.
Ouch. We're going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, what will you do, Megan? The sniper came after you, but it's now officially sold to you for 32. Congrats. Congratulations, Megan. Megan. You got yourself a buffalo. Very nice. Thank you, ma'am. And uh, thank you, Hi Hole. And again, it's good to see you. Um, and we'll just update your invoice on this. Todd. Todd, you got the uh, SMS set, so uh, I will look at 15, so it should be 1850, right? 1855. Okay, 1855, Todd. Thank you, Todd. You type that in the chat for him. Do I? I'll do it. What? I said, can you type that in chat for him? Okay. Miss shipping, Todd. And Megan got that for thirty-two. Yep. Alrighty, next up. Oh, isn't that special? Nineteen sixty-one uncirculated mint set. Wally, we love you. Wally, my love. I know, sir. Got, well, I think that's why he was looking for Friday's spreadsheet because he wasn't going to be able to make Thursday. Oh, I don't know. So what we have here is the uncirculated mint set from 1961. So you're going to get two of all of these. There's your 61 Philly. <laughs> Franklin, quarter, nickel, dime, and cent. And then, of Helen. And then, we, <laughs> and then we have the Denvers, and you're going to get the 61 Denver, 61 Denver quarter, dime, nickel, and cent. So two have two 90% halves, two 90% quarters, and two 90% dimes, along with the nickel and cents. And I'm looking for $35 to open this up. If we have the interest, that is wonderful we don't so have... we got mr peggy hunts everything at 35 hello and phe hello mr peggy how are you today sir it's good to see you dove season comes in at 36 i was in it now sorry i have to go but bye everyone thanks and have a good wonderful you too todd thank you for coming in thank you, you todd make it tonight great if not no worries but Please. thank you for coming in your support we appreciate it great to see you buddy and hello, Mr. Baggy. Yes, ma'am. If we don't see you tonight, Todd, we will definitely see you on Sunday night at Redneck Metals Auction. So there you have it. So we have Peggy Hunts, Mr. Peggy Hunts everything at $40 now. Peggy, Dove Season was in at $36 now. Mr. Peggy is in Johnny at 40 Ray. Comes Johnny in at Ray, $45. The Highway Man, Johnny, $45. Johnny Ray, he finally got to stop and just breathe it. I don't, are you breathing, Johnny? <laughs> He's not sleeping. We want to know. <laughs> we want to know. Are you breathing? <laughs> Daughter number two is on her way over shortly. Shortly or on her way? Shortly. She wanted okay. to know if we needed anything. Time. Dove season to miss, is out to Mr. Peggy Hunts Everything. Thank you, Dove season. So we have Mr. Oh, we have Johnny Ray at 45, excuse me. And Mr. Peggy is out. Thank you, sir. So we're all in all done. Johnny Ray, the highway man. He's choking on peanut m and <laughs> Yeah, because that season. Oh, wait, that season. Are you in? Nope, oh, you're out. out. We're all in all done. Going twice. Fair warning. Johnny Ray. Fair highway. warning. Oh, Johnny Ray. You're sniping and picking up a great set of coins today with love from Helen. 
<laughs> Congrats, Sold the John Johnny. Ray for forty-five dollars. Shirley is going to be so happy with you. That I was mean, Helen. Yeah, uh, Helen, Shirley, and Wally. The whole family. Yep. <laughs> Thank you, Johnny. We that, appreciate you, that buddy. Was a lot. What? Twenty-three. Okay. We'll put Wonderful. that in your package. I'm breathing he and says, still awake. Breathing, still awake, and winning on bids. What more could a man ask? Right on. Maybe an In-N-Out burger. Okay. <laughs> close idea. Thank you, Diane. Yep. Next up. Is the door unlocked, by the way? It will be. Okay, just checking, man. She said in a little bit. What is this? Okay, here's what I have up next. This is a three nines fine silver round. Okay. And it says, The right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. A well-regulated militia being necessary to <clears throat> the security of the United States. Or to the security of free state. A free state. Yeah. And then on the reverse... It is we, the people, and the eagle. And this, is, again, is three nines fine, silver, one ounce. Very cool looking round. I actually bought this for a bell, but I went a different direction because. Hey, Money Maniacs. Good to see you. Hello, Money Maniacs. Thank How you are you? Thank for coming. We have Dove season at 33. Redneck comes in at 35. Hi ho is at 35 as well, but Dove came back at 36. <gasps> Dove is at 36 first, guys. Looking for 37. Breathe, Diane. Breathe. Hi ho comes in at 37. Thank you all for your I'm bids. breathing. Okay, just checking. Thank you, Jonathan. <laughs> There's a lot going on. Redneck comes back at 40. Welcome back, Shaw. Thank you, Red. We have Red in at $40 on this. Hi ho came back at 41. Smack. They're duking it, those two. Boom. Da boom. Da boom. Out back under the rocks, says Bigfoot. Uh, <laughs> Doggone mother rancher. Bigfoot, I love you, brother. Even if you are a fighting Sioux fan. Hey, Native Warriors here. Hello, Native Warrior. How good are to you? See you? Native Warrior. Woohoo. It is good to see you. Thank you, Dove Season. Dove Season is. O U T, dang a bit, dang nabbit too. Dang nabbit. One dang day I'll learn how to read. That's a suck. Ready to go, hi ho. 45. Absolutely, money maniacs. Good to see you. So, Red's at 45, looking for 46. Thank you, Red. I'm going to flip this round one more time. And that is the We the People side. With the Bill of Rights. Hi ho says big dog, get on the porch. 50. Okay, he didn't say all that. Just kidding. I had to ad lib. Welcome back, Malvado. How are you, buddy? Thank you. Red is out. High hole wins, says Red. I hear you, Red. I uh sorry, Patriots Mom. Red was Red was uh was in there for you, ma'am. Thank you, uh Todd. Yes, goods and services, please. Very nice, Todd. Thank you. Oz is calling her down, going once. Hello, CVS. How are you, sir? We're going once to high hole silver. The man from down under. Going twice. And sold high hole fifty dollars. Thank you, high hole, and congratulations, buddy.
Very nice. Of course. Yes, please. <laughs> you don't answer to of course, I guess, anymore. Thank you, uh thank you, Movado. There you are. Dub season. Got and... to run. What is my total with shipping for the two? Oh, you got to. Okay, rather than me send you an invoice. Okay. So it's $8. And... I'm looking. Did he win? Oh, it was the two. It was just the one lot. So $8 plus three fifty-five. How much to turn that into a ring? Um, I'll talk to you after the auction hi ho i'll shoot you an email but i'll just put a note on here with a question mark and we'll talk hope that's all right hi ho but i have okay that season cool okay i'll send you an invoice hey cvs so hi ho got that for 50 for 50 yeah lot 24 for hi ho and he yeah. wants to turn it into a ring? Possibly. I will email him and talk about that. Okay. Thank you, Hi Ho. Alrighty. Next up. Once again, to Wally and Shirley this time. 20th anniversary, 2 5 1975. Well, we're getting way too much information on that family. <laughs> now, this is a 58 proof set. And. Now, there's a piece of tape up here that I'm not going to take off. But I think it would come off just fine. Um, it may leave a little red residue, but you should be able to clean that up as well. But nonetheless, here's the half dollar, the quarter. <clears throat> Nickel, dime. And this is the 58 silver proof set. Oh, that's that half has, uh, has a chance at some cameo. And maybe the dime. I'm going to look at the obverses again. Nope. And the half is a maybe. That's right, Oz. Getting closer to skeletons in the closet. So anyway, if we have any interest in this, $35 is the opening bid. 1958 silver proof set. Fred McGee says, <laughs> I like Wally and Shirley. I'm in. I'm in. Hey, Fred McGee. Thank you for coming in. Oh, thank you for your thank email. Thank you, Fred. And that's all covered and taken care of. We have Fred thank just you. before you. Last thank you, sir. So we have Fred McGee at 35. 1958 silver proof set. Come on now, camera. Or not camera, but and great to see you, Fred McGee. There's a story. Not to be confused with Fred Carson. Oh no. <laughs> so many different connections, yeah. You're not sure. What are you sure about? Fred or Johnny Ray. How about how much information we have going on in the in the Wally? What's her names? I don't know. Burgess Bridges family. Right. I have a uh, I have that other stuff set aside for you, Johnny. If that's what you're wondering about. So oh, yeah. I, I do have one of these 58s put aside for you. So Les is out. Thank you, Les. Thank you, Les. We're going once. Fred Carson at 35. Looking for 36. Going twice. We're going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, what will you do? Pizza guy came in at 36 too. So, Fred, you need 37. Sniper, sniper, pizza guy. Fred McGee comes in at 37. Now we're looking for 38, and Fred Carson comes in at 38. Oh, my goodness. We got Fred McGee, Fred Carson, and the pizza guy. Look at there. Two Freds and a pizza. <laughs> hey, pizza guy. How are you? Good to see you, pizza guy. Right on. Johnny Ray, I hear you. <laughs> 
And Sherry Ward comes in. Ooh, but came after Fred McGee at 39. Pizza comes in at 40. Ooh, Fred McGee comes in at 42. Fred Carson at 43. Sherry Ward, we need 44. Babe. Hi, Sherry. How are you today, ma'am? Great to see you, Sherry. She says, I'm out. Pizza guy's bidding. <laughs> right. Two pizzas, at, two Freds and a pizza. That's right. Looks like a Where's Hallmark movie. <laughs> Right on, Oz. We got Fred McGee at 45. <laughs> Good to see you, Sherry Ward. Thank you guys for coming in. Fred Carson comes in at 47. Thank we got you, Fred. Fred McGee at 45. Now Fred Carson at 47. Pizza guy. What will you do? He says, I'll climb out. Thank you, pizza guy. That's great he to says, see I'm you. I'm not going to fight between two pizzas. There are two Freds. He said, I, I supply the pizza now. Once and now we have Fred McGee at 50. There we go. Fred McGee at $50. Did you? Yeah, you got to kind of watch that. I know. I know. I was, I was exactly. So we got Fred McGee at $50 looking for 51 What to do, Fred Carson? It's up to you, Fred Carson. Right on, so, Oz. They kind of got me, I think it was last night on Point Out, or that, yesterday afternoon. All the coin ops? Yeah. I thought That's it was really cool. one, so and then I realized the they were both there. And we're going once. Which email? RC Pops, did you put it to? I haven't seen it yet today, RC, but I'll check. You know what? I need to be checking email. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh yeah, yes. Sorry about that. I will look at that. Yep. The 74D no neck. Gotcha, RC Pops. Sold to Fred for 50. Congratulations. Congratulations, Fred. Fred McGee. Not to be conf confused with Fred C. It's Fred McGee. Didn't he? Fred. Nope, this is his first one today, right? Yes. The other one would be the lovely and talented Fred Carson. <laughs> <laughs> lovely and talented, eh? That's funny. Uh, thank you, Fred McGee. We appreciate that. Let me get this put back in here. And... Funny. Two Freds and a pizza. Right on, uh, RC pops. Thank That's you, cool buddy. How that worked out. Can you write that on there? Fred, yeah. Right. Okay. Close. Now, next up, I'm going to show you the whole coin to start with. Then we're going to go under the the microscope, and I'll show you the uh, the uh, error on it. So what we have here is a. 1866 three cent nickel extra fine 45 by annex uh, no by ngc i'm gonna say not annex. there we go so extra fine 45. hello roger how's it going so glad you guys came in glad roger he's a guy oh Hey, hey, pizza guy. We're on a first name basis. Okay, I'm going to go to the other. Because <laughs> this has a... Thank you, Fred. This has a... Um, what am I trying to say? This has some die cracks. and uh, I believe it's a retained cud. I have to look again. So here is your obverse. There's your date. Now that second six looks funny. I haven't checked into that, so that might be something you might want to look at. But let me flip it over, and we will show it to you. It's not a nickel. Nickels are five cents. Oh, it's made out of nickel. Made out of nickel. He knows he's just being silly. So there is your cud, right there. Oh, do they really? That's They're a all... rim to rim die break. And you have another one here, but that I wonder die why break that is. down there, and it looks almost like it has a lamination peel. It's but it's a pimp. I don't think so. Pud. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll just scan that reverse a little bit. Oh, let me go. 
you can see a little bit right there as well to the east of the uh, three bars so yeah that that whole area there from right there all the way over to here has remnants of that die crack and I don't think I have either Roman uh, this one right here I think I would oh, that's weird I would consider that a retained cut I believe retained cut yes interesting but that being said let me pull this back a little bit and see if we can get a better look at just the whole coin Ooh. wow there we go a lot of stuff going on there huh there is a lot so there you can see there is a lot going on on the bottom and the east side of that that reverse so 60 dollars opening bid on this one and animals know. chew their cud all the time. <laughs> Fred Carson. I haven't seen one of these in ages, it seems. And there's the obverse there. So that's a cud. Yes. Okay. A lot of times it shows up as a big glob, like on a penny. But that's what I think the way that one looks. It almost looks like a lamb peel. So I think it's a considered a retained cud. I'd have to look. There's so many different terms for for that stuff. There's, um, go back to the other camera now. And whoop. Hmm. There we go. Not that it is a retained cud. What? I just, that's what I. Paul Hampton. I'm repeating Paul. Oh. Paul, you're kind of a retained cud, but. You take an offer, Joe. Yep. Sure, Paul. Let me flip that over. Or Starbucks. He needs to see that. He's uh, chewing on some cud somewhere. <laughs> yep. Take 55 for it. Paul Hampton at 55. You bet. Any other bidders? Go ahead and start calling that down, Oz. I'll take that as, as a bin. As a bin. Buy it now. Well, I got to give everybody a chance. So let's have them call it down. But yep. Okay, we got 55. Thank you, Oz. Going once. Going once. Going once. Going twice. Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, will you do, Pollywog? This cut's coming to you. Paul's room is still available. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Paul. <laughs> Sold to Paul for 55. Congratulations, Paul. That's going to come to you, buddy. 1866, three cent nickel. And that's lot 26? Yep. All right. Thank you, sir. We appreciate your bid there, Paul Hampton. Nice pickup there, Paul Hampton. Paul the Cud Hampton. <laughs> As Starbucks so affectionately calls him. Thank you, Paul. Congrats, buddy. Moving right along, we have a couple items left here. And next up, I have a 1922. 22 piece dollar. Let me see if I put my little. And I'm looking for $30 to open this up. Oop, let me get that out of the way and let me show you the reverse. There's your Denver Mint Mark. Little coloring starting, but it has strong details yet. And okay, right, right on, Oz. We got you, buddy. I was wondering. And that okay. obverse, that's not a big gouge. It's like a uh, how do I put it? Like a little scuff no in the coloring. You know what I mean? It didn't uh dig into the coin necessarily so we're looking for thirty dollars to open that if we have any interest that's wonderful if we don't that's wonderful as well nathaniel lee is here hey nathaniel how are you sir so again 22 denver no we're good nathaniel we got it covered but thank you we will definitely keep you 
Thank you, Daniel. We appreciate that. Yeah, we guess yeah. we are right here. For now, yeah. Les likes coins. Hi, Les likes coins. Hello, Les. Chained is a die break from rim to rim. A cut is where the piece of the die fell out and the metal fills the void. Right. It will be a smooth area from the rim to the coin. Oh, okay. Thanks, Paul. That's why I was saying it was a retained. Well, I think the first thing I said was retained die break, but yes, because... Uh, well, it's not, Shaw. I have probably 50 piece so dollars. I don't buy them from. Just let me. Uh, I just don't generally buy them on things. I buy them in bulk, not one at a time. So. But, um. Right on, Paul. And that's what I was trying to explain. Joe is. Sharp. Hello. Comes in with a bit of 30. Thank you, Joe Sharp. Sorry to interrupt you. I just, it just, oh, <laughs> I forgot he was here. <laughs> He was right enjoying on, enjoying the visit. I'm going to show the reverse again. 22 Denver. <laughs> Did you really? Ooh, BLT, that sounds really good, Sh Sherry Ward. No, You're I didn't. Cooking dinner? Good thing. No, okay, Sha. We didn't take it that way, Sha. <laughs> no worries. You just caught this? Well, Fred Carson came in at 31, so now, oh, I should be doing this. Joe came in at 30. Thank you, Fred. Thank you, Joe. Fred Carson comes in at 31. I forgot Oswald's in here. <laughs> I can, no, that's, I'll take the other half, please, says AZ. <laughs> so we got Fred Carson at 31, BLT. looking for 32. You're welcome. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Looking for 32. Anyone, anyone, hi ho, comes in with us. What do you call Thank those? you, hi ho, super chat, super sticker. Thank Cover you. your ears and grab your cheeks. That train's a rolling. And everybody, remove your headphones. Thank you. Thank so you, hi ho. Hi ho, you rock. Hello, Inkman. How are you today, buddy? Great to see you, Ink Man. He's got bacon and tacos. So a bacon taco. <gasps> Hector's <laughs> interest is here. Any great idea? Um, Hello, Hector. Joe, uh, that's this. your 4K from. Oh. Do the listening. I just do the bookwork. I, just I would have to. I would go. <laughs> I would say high XF, low AU would be my. Just looking quickly at it. Probably, I'd say XF to be safe. <laughs> right on, Joe. I understand, buddy. Take care. We understand oh so well. In fact, hope you're doing well today, Hector. Coming in. Awesome, for Lloyd. That's awesome. You're welcome. Oh, there we go. There so, go. as far all in, all done. Last call. Last call, says the lady. We're going once. Going once. Oh, snap. Right on, My Hector. Screen go. We appreciate you being in here, buddy. Going twice. I'm going to find. We're going twice, going twice, going twice. Oh, come on, computer. Uh, Fair warning. Fair warning. Oh, so the Fred Carson do? for 31. Thank you, Fred Carson. Congratulations, Fred Carson. All right. Very nice, Fred. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sir. The girls and the front his daughter and the girls are there, and Fred Joe was having trouble concentrating. Yes, I was. Oh, that Joe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You're Joe, too. Congratulations, uh, Fred. I got to find Fred Carson's sheet. His sheet? He's everywhere in here. Oh, I thought he was closer to the front. You guys hear that? That was not Velcro. That was there he is. The slab sack. How much was that again? 31. 31, ma'am. 
Now, next up, I will. Are you copy. posting? You want me to? I'm I can doing do. it. Just okay. Couldn't get my fifty-eight. I wanted. Oh, I'm sorry. So we well, have you opening had video. a good try at it, Fred. Thank you. Next up, I have a 1939 Denver with the reverse of a 38 Jefferson Nickel Mint State 65 by NGC. Let me find my little auto focuser. Maybe that was just a bit. I gotta go up and look real quick. So 39 Denver. And this has the reverse of uh, uh, the 38. And it does not have full steps. Now I, I can take a moment and explain to you the... Uh, the reverse of a 39. Or a 38, excuse me. Now what that they're referring to is... That's right, patent pending autofocuser right here. <laughs> um, how do I do this? Okay, now when they're, we're talking about the reverse of the 38 or 40, in 1938 or 1939, there was two different reverse designs that they used. The one was the 38 and the other was from 1940. Um, so the 1938 reverse is going to be wavy steps. They're not going to be as clear. And the 1940 has sharper details and a straighter set of steps on the reverse of the Monticello building. Um, so the 39 with the reverse of the 38, it was pretty much, it was just produced for a short period of time. And it's the scarcer of the two varieties. So I hope that explains things enough for you and you'd have to just look them up on uh, at your microscope all your 39s and look at the steps and you can tell pretty easily if you look at the two different reverse types firsthand you'll know but anyway we're looking for 75 dollars to open this up if we have any interest 75 and that's a mint state 65 by ngc So we're looking for 75 to open this up. And if we don't have an interest, you can just last call. Shut her down. Yep. Going once. You just learned something less. It you know, they're cool, supposed less. to show you. You've been collecting coins as long as you have. You know what? And I'll... you're still learning. Isn't that cool? Hopefully I didn't uh bit close. Thank you guys for for your time on that one anyway. And I hope I was able to share some useful information. A little bit of education on that one, huh? Right on. Pretty cool. I like education. Me too. <laughs> All right, well this one doesn't need any explaining to do. Okay, that's not what we want. We already did that one, didn't we? Yeah. Two more left. So what we have up next. Thanks, Wes. We appreciate you, buddy. One ounce proof silver bullion coin. Well, what is that? It's an American Eagle. So I'll take out that nice box there. And we have another box. And inside there is your pertinent information. This is a 1986 San Francisco three nines fine silver one ounce ASE and this is proof first year of issue and this is Terry at 45 thank you Terry let me get that out of there there we go I'll show you the reverse there's your estimate mark so first year of issue proof American Silver Eagle and we have Terry at 45. Thank you, Terry. That is nice. No, yeah, that's I there's really nothing like a proof silver eagle, but the 
the uh, cameo devices just they pop at you. I love that design. Right. The walking liberty design, and it's it's cool. She looks so graceful, like mm -hmm. she's walking in the wind. Oh, she's graceful. She looks just like you in my eyes, honey. Just like you. Can't we say suck it up? Suck it up. <laughs> We have Majestic at 50. Thank you, Majestic. And we have the Herald Eagle, Eagle Reverse, of course. Right there. Ink says she's a beauty. Well, thank you, Ink Man. Appreciate that. Yep, she sure is. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Ink Man. Couldn't so we have Majestic at $50. <laughs> thank you, Majestic. At Terry at 51. We got a battle, Terry and Majestic. We got a battle be between the two. Amazing guys, my stalker and majestic. Actually, it's my turn to be stalking. Hmm. I've been stalking him lately, so he's well, got stalking relief. <laughs> okay. We have the stalker and big sexy. Big sexy is majestic. Yeah, big, I can't say that. That would just be inappropriate. You didn't have to. I did. There you go, majestic. It's all done. There you go, majestic. <laughs> I got you covered. So we got Terry at 51 looking for 52. He goes 55. Even if he does wear pink. I'll just leave that alone. It's okay to wear pink. Yep, it is. When you're big sexy, you can wear anything you want. Yeah, there is no. Oh, Terry says he's out. Thank, Thank you, Terry. Terry. No, this one <laughs> doesn't have any cloudy spots. That You're right, <laughs> Paul. So we have... Majestic sounds of coins. <laughs> and Diane is calling it down. Thank you, Majestic. Yep, we're going once, going twice. Oh, well, we last call, then we're going twice. Oh, wish I had my issue worked out. I would all be in on it's getting there, right? It's getting there. So, sold Majestic for $55. Thank you, Majestic. Congratulations, Majestic. Thank you, Terry, for your bid. Yes, thank you, Terry. Congrats, buddy. He's trying so hard. It really was. Majestic, that'll go in your box. Thank you, my friend. And very, very cool beans. Back in that bag. There we go. Final. Our final item for this afternoon's auction. Last, but definitely not least. Mr. Doughboy is in here. Hello, Mr. Doughboy. Hello. Thank you for coming. And please remember, everybody, that 7 o'clock Central, we will be doing part two of this auction. And that will be all world coins and sets. Here, let me post that spreadsheet. Thank you, Diane. Did you put up the next lot yet? Not yet, but okay. I will right after I do this. All right. There's tonight's spreadsheet, everybody. Welcome back, Motated. I got to email that one out, too, in a little bit. But you get it from here now. Those who are here get to get it early. All right. Posted. I'm going to pop this out of this little flip that it's in. And what we have here is a 1942 over one Denver Mercury Dime. $350 to open. And that is about $80 under current market value that NGC, et cetera, have. Oh, look at that. Now, I'm going to put it under the microscope, and I will show you the variety. Here comes the variety, guys, which makes this valuable. Yes, ma'am. Very, very valuable. I know, hi ho, right? All right, so here is... And it's a Merc. Here's oh. your coin to begin with, and let me... Zoom in on that variety. Ink <laughs> man's got his eyes big and wide open. He's working. He's looking. He's looking. I'm looking. I get a little closer than that. Sorry about this. Oh wow. All right. Oh, there we go. Oh. Very finicky here. Okay, so what we got going here is where's my pointy? <laughs> Coming out the bottom of the four, you see little remnants of extra metal. That needs to be there. That is a marker. But right here is your extra one. The top of the two, you can see a little bit here on the inside curl of the two. And 
there's a little dirt here, but coming out the bottom of the tube, there is also, uh, there you can maybe see it better. There I can see it on the bottom of the two. You see the rest of that one. So right there. And then at the top uh, west of the curl is the rest of that. And then there's like mechanical doubling on the four a little bit. But that's a, just a marker for the 42 over one. You bet, Fred Carson, no problem. And so that is the variety. Let me pull back a little bit and show you the whole coin. And I would say this is, this is fine. Yeah, I'd give this a fine. A high fine. Hmm. And let me flip that over. So there's your reverse. Okay, Fred, I can update that on Saturday night if you want me to do that. Oh, that's cool, Fred. Uh, Fred, um, Les. Isn't that cool? So that's what we have. 1942 over one. <laughs> I know, right, Ink Fan? Denver. Like, hmm, what if I... Oh, look Merc at that Don. on the torch. What about the torch? Hmm? What do you see? Right now, I just see the obverse, so I gotta wait. Okay, now I'm looking. There's your D-mint mark. That does not have full bands, of course. No. Uh, but it looks like it. I could just be. Sorry, Fred. That that won't won't it's even Fred get McBee you. comes in at seventy five. No, he does not. This is three hundred and fifty dollar opening bid. Oh, <laughs> sorry, Fred. That's a no. <laughs> oh, thanks, Fred. That's Carson. right, Fred. You are so sweet. Nice try, though, Fred. <laughs> oh, he says three hundred fifty. Okay. Thank you, Fred. Very, very nice of you, Fred. <laughs> he was back at the other one. He must have typed and went forward. Right. It was the same. Yeah. That typo thing. I was going to, I was going to uh, send this off if that just I didn't gets get a bit on flip, it today. Says Floyd. <laughs> <laughs> that is such a cool coin. So I appreciate that. Interesting work. Hey, Joe says, Inkman says, lay away, Joe. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, I had, uh, well, that's just another story that I'll get to another time, but. <laughs> it must be really windy. I'm seeing shadows at the I door. I thought I won. I thought I, I had the 42 plane. <laughs> your bidding, bo your bidding bookie board is 10 feet away. Paul, oh, that's funny. <laughs> and I, uh, you can go ahead and call this down. Back. All right. Anyway, We're looking I for a 355 would... if anyone's interest. Did. <laughs> but all in, all done. Last call. I thought I was, uh bidding on a, or I thought I had the Philly and it was bidding on a Denver. Well, after I won this one, I realized I already had the slab Denver. It wasn't a Philly. So this was an extra. And then I was going to send this off to Annex if it did not sell today. So thank you, Fred. That's very awesome. We're going once. Fair warning. Piho is sitting on his hands. Sold to Fred McGee at 350. Thank you, Fred McGee. Thank you, Fred. Hey, Congratulations. Never have to be sorry, Oz. We appreciate all your help always. And that was our last auction item of the day. You take payments until Christmas? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> We're no longer going to be your. Whatever bankers. you got to do, Polly. <laughs> no more spam. No there you go, spam. Fred. That's right. Thank you very much. And right. uh, you got a good deal on that. I can tell you right now, I sold that to you cheaper than I paid for it. So very nice. And just so you guys know, I'm not going to do invoices Fred. until after tonight. After because then I have auction. to update again. And why? Yeah, after tonight's auction. There you go. So, Diane, you posted the new list for tonight, right? I did. I'll do it again. And that will be coming. We will send that out. To the emails. To the email list. If anybody would like to be on the email. Hey, Billy P., how are you today, buddy? 
Thank you for coming, Billy P. Glad you are here. If you are not on our email list and would like to be, just shoot us an email. On that email, that. scrolling down the bottom of the screen. And we will be sure. Thank you, Fred. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, so we're going to be back in two hour, two and a half hours. And we have two giveaways we're going to do right now, though. So hang with me. And you never know, we may have a giveaway tonight. So our first one is from Peggy Hunts Everything. And she bought this quarter. It's a proof 1964 quarter. And she said, give it away. So that's going to be our first giveaway. We're going to pick a number or a letter. Please Two use capitals. caps. And uh, when I type go in, bad. I, I did see that, Fred Mingy. That's why I said we got your email. Everything's taken care of. Or for Tuesday night, yeah. That's right. The most expensive quarter sold in the last 20 years. <laughs> All right. So I have, do I have the letter? Here, I need, Diane's going to write me down a letter and then I'm going to type go in the chat so that I can uh, scroll back and see. So we don't have that problem that we had the other day where right. I couldn't go back far enough. Um, Please use capital letters. And uh, after I hit go, Guess as many times as you would like. And good luck, everybody. Who's typing go? I am. Okay. And there we go. Good luck, everyone. Good luck, everybody. And here we go. Okay. Stop, 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 okay. stop, stop, stop. 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 All right. Here we go. Giveaway number one. The letter is I. Now I'm going to scroll back up to the start. Here we go. Let me get you on the camera here. Oh, 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 oh. All right, I'm going to go over to here then. There is go. <coughs> okay. Sorry, I had to switch screens. So there's go. Now I'm going to go down. I'm looking for I. <laughs> is that, That's cool. Is that an I or an L? That's an L. Native okay. warrior yep. is an L. Thank you. Yep. Cirque is an L. That's why we do caps. Hold it. I'm going back. Where was the eye that you see? Just under Cirque's message held for review. Up. Okay. Cirque. Well, if that's an I, then that well, first one was. Well, that, you got to go way up. So I'm, I'm sorry. Going back. There's my go. So that is an I, right? There, Dizzy Giraffe. Yes. Sorry about that. So Dizzy Giraffe coins. You won the first giveaway, a 1964 proof quarter. If you are not uh, registered, could you please shoot us an email? Well, shoot us an email. Oh, and along with your address and everything so we can ship that to you. Is it caps? Yes. Yeah, I so I got it right I. there. <laughs> Peggy. Yeah, Dizzy Giraffe was the first one. So thank you, Dizzy. And now we're going to do one more. So Dizzy, send Joe an email with all your details so we can get that mailed off to you. I'm going to put your name on here. Thank you, Dizzy. And congratulations, Giraffe. Just in time there. Okay, the next one is a 1967 special mint set, 40% uh, silver Kennedy half dollar. Baby Hello, boy. Alex. How are you, sir? How are you, honey? Hey, Matt83. 
Hey, Matt 83, how Great are to you? See you guys. So I'm going to type go in one more. You don't have to sit out dizzy, but I appreciate that. Um, I'm going to type go one more time. When I do go, please use all capitals. And uh, good luck, everyone. And here we go. Let's go, go, go. Maybe. Oh, oops. What's the letter? I forgot. Okay. And. Whoa, stop. that was I got fast. It. You got Thank it you already? Thank you very much. Stop. Stop, stop. <laughs> Look at there. Who's that? There's, Say hi. There's a little buddy. Look at Papa's. Hey, Look at Papa. hey buddy. Look at Papa buddy. over there. Look buddy. Here. Look hey. At hey, buddy. Hi, Papa. <laughs> what a face. What are you looking at me like that for, chump? <laughs> All right, let's go back and see who won. Oh, my goodness. Sorry about that. Okay, there's my go, and we are looking for. <laughs> That's funny. Sorry about this. We are looking for the letter Q. Oh, yeah, we got to show the letter first. Let me know. Okay, let me get a little closer. All right. And. Oh, hope nothing's urgent in there. Okay, go and. Oh wow. D B. Go go, boom! Oh, look at there, Q. Happy Paul Hampton, the Spaminator. <laughs> yep. And. Right above, I'm not too bad. How is you? I'm doing great, Alex. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Congratulations, Paul Hampton. Thank you, Paul. That's going to come to you, my friend. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's the next Minnesota millionaire, aren't you? That's yeah, right. Yeah, that's oh, right. Oh, oh. You little suck up. Oh. <laughs> you love it. Hey, you love hey him. buddy, mm -hmm. don't be a chump. <laughs> Look at Grim. Hey, hey, right. I'm talking to you. Look at them teeth. The teeth are really coming out. He's got a couple coming in, too. All right. Thank you, guys. We are going to call this an auction. Um, we will see you guys all in two hours and 15 minutes or something like that. So thank you for all the support today. We I'm appreciate each and every one of you. Sorry I missed you guys. Oh, that's okay. 7 o'clock Central. See you again tonight. Oh. We're doing the double header. Come on, now. there we go. Header. That's what I wanted to do. How are you doing, Stay. son of a silver stacker? Good to Ready? see you. <laughs> thank you, G Dub. We appreciate that. Um, thank you, Dizzy. So yeah, everybody have a great afternoon. We we'll hope to see you all back in uh, a couple hours. And remember, we have the Gleason, the Gleason uh, benefit auction is tonight as well. So I'm going to be over there just before we go live, and uh, I'm going to auction off a bell for Gleason and his wife. High five, Oz. Great auction, Oz. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> Alex, you missed it all. We're doing another one in two hours. So, 7 o'clock Central? Well, yeah. Yes, Do Megan. We... I will send you an email about buying a bell. All right, guys. Take care. God bless. And we will see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye, guys. Thank you. See you later.